Of course, at the beginning, I'm dropping stuff. Alright, right, did I do it? YouTube is always the one that takes the longest, so I had to check that first. Is it... Is it working? Gosh, I hope this doesn't show anything either. We're not seeing anything leakage, right? I hope not. No. Alright. That looks good. How is... Where is my Twitch going at? Working? Ah. Oh. Is it... There we go. Okay. <laughs> We're back. We're finally in. Hello, Anna. Can I smoosh? I can't. Okay, so chat is just gonna look tiny. Um, do I... figure out like a good spot maybe there maybe that's a better spot that's a fine enough spot all right hello anna how is your beautiful self okay well there goes my audio gosh dang it i need to get a new mix amp i think that's my biggest issue there we go can you dab mrs streamer <laughs> i'm not dabbing for you not for you tyler <laughs> How's my nest? Tired! Good gosh, I'm tired. I woke up not even like an hour ago. Can you please dabby dab? Do a dibbity dab? Listen, I'll do a dibbity dab if I ever hit 100 followers on Twitch. That's when I'll do a dab. Is that fair? I think that's pretty fair. Um, okay. Plans for today. Scary games, of course. We're gonna continue to do That's Not My Neighbor. I really, really, really like That's Not My Neighbor. I want to figure out what the whole meaning of life answer is. I'm, I'm going to expect I'm probably going to have to look that up because I am not really that savvy with it. Uh, or just like, I don't really remember much. Um, so what? That's not my neighbor. I'm not even typing. That's great. <laughs> That's not my Answer. The neighbor. Wait. What? Uh, this is. I'm going to lurk and type a thousand numbers into spreadsheets. Have fun. So this is. This is this this is the answer, which I don't get. Hold on, where did my where did my okay there it is. I how do you get forty two? And then the, this must have been like googled or something. The first one being forty two is crazy. This is even the only sport that allows you to punch your opponent in the face because they captured a piece. <laughs> what? At least how many times? Ooh. Okay, so I'm gonna keep this to the side. All right, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna keep this to the side, and then this is what I'll use for whenever we actually get in. Okay, so. And I also want to play this game, for sure. We're playing this one. We're going to be playing, um, That's Not My Neighbor. Then we're going to be getting through a, a couple of these. And then we'll hit up Kindman for the last, like, hour to two hours, maybe. Because Kindman takes a long time. And I feel like, I I'm going to be honest, like, one hour of Kindman doesn't really seem like we're going to progress much. So we might have to, like, do, like, two hours of Kindman. Plus, I want to get through the story. And I think it's, like, 60 days long. From my guesses, I think it's 60 days long. So we'll see. Um, so let us... That's not my neighbor. And let's turn off this... 
What? Why is my Steam big picture turning on? Uh, n no. N no. Why did you do that? When did I ever ask for that? Oh, I must have clicked that. Eh. Okay, launch this. Alright. Let's see how well we're gonna do this time. Hopefully the volume. There you go, that looks pretty good. That's not my neighbor. Uh, record. We kind of went, uh, we, we kind of failed. I kind of killed someone last time. <laughs> Whoops. But yeah, I wanna, wh where is it? Complete Chester's quiz. Is that it? Or is it something else? No, discover the universe. Maybe it's that one. Chester has a quiz? Who's Chester? Surviving without an opening, without opening a folder? I, I will do that. That is, I want to do that. Alright, oh, hold on. I freaking ate a Pop-Tart and now the wrapper's like in the way. Menu. Alright, let's get into it. I'm ready. Oh, let's get this. I always forget to skip it. <laughs> I'm just like, oh, what's this? Cutscene? <gasps> I'm ready. I haven't seen a decent cutscene in so long. Hey, yeah, goodbye. Is there anything around here? No, this thing. Oh, that actually- Whoa, wait, hold on, what? Oh, should we try this today? A little dice game with a somewhat hungry clown. Originally, how to play. Match the dice of the cards, not necessarily, not necessarily the same position. For each matched dice, you get one point. That doesn't seem difficult at all. Ooh, maybe we should try this one day. I'll definitely have to keep that keep that pinned. Text for important sounds, text for important colors. I think we're fine on that. How do I back out? Free me. Ooh. Hey! Alright, you look good. This looks good. 68 Roman Stilski. Yep. Ooh, there's not a lot of people on that list. Ooh, ooh, big nose, scar chin. Yeah, you look good, but you're missing your entry request, bro. I'm the rest of the building I come from my home as a public accountant. Is this the one that we killed? Is he the one that we killed? Cause here it just says accountant. It doesn't say public accountant. Oh, should we let him in? I think this is who we killed last time and I messed up. Oh no. Um, gosh, his numbers. I totally forgot his numbers. My brain is like on slow mode right now. 483924483924059684059684. I think this is the guy that we accidentally killed because it said public accountant and I was like thinking that it's just a regular accountant. I mean, I don't get it. Okay, I'm letting him in. He didn't speak. He didn't speak. They usually go. Blah, blah, blah. Yeah, they go like that. They didn't. They didn't. They she did. They didn't do that. Uh. Okay. Might have killed someone, but that's fine. We love murder. Hello. Okay. Anastasia Michaelis. Anastasia Michaelis. Yep. Anastasia Michaelis. 5024. Yep. Tired eyes, two point tail, small nose, round face. Yeah, that looks good. 1326985. Got it. And I'm here, whatever, in my apartment is yeah i mean she's truthful 
This person looks good. You look good. You're good. No need to doubt. I'm not doubt. I'm gonna try not to doubt myself, but I think I brought at least one doppelganger in already. We just started. Hello? You, you're not on the list. Uh, don't you live on the first floor? No. Don't you live on the third floor? Yes, you do. What do you want? Look at the list again. You're wrong. Um, one, four, two, five. One, four, two, five. One, four, two, five. One, four, two, five. We'll call your wife. Is he home? Hello? Hello, Mia speaking. My fiance is not home. Okay. Thank you. Well, that helps. Afton. Love that last name. We'll never forget it. F301. I'm resident building. My apartment is 01. On the third floor. That's truthful. Robust eyebrows. Oh, yeah. Those eyebrows are robust. Wears glasses. Short hair. Round nose. Square head. Wears glasses. Short hair. Round nose. Square head. Yep. Uh, 2504896. Five. I forget the numbers. Two five zero four eight nine six five six two one four six two one four. Okay, numbers still like we have never encountered wrong numbers, so I don't know if we will ever encounter that. But all this looks good. Oh, you're not on the list though. Bye. Good gosh, that beeping is loud. I raised the volume just a little bit on my end, and it freaking year like four years. Hello. So many people are, are on the list. You're not on the list. Wait, you live on the second floor, right? Yeah, you do. Five, one, two, three. I, I, there's nothing. There's nothing here. I can't flip the page or anything. Stupid. Uh, what is it? Five, one, two, three. <gasps> I remembered. Hello. Hello. Gloria speaking. My husband and I are in the apartment right now. We're not expecting any visitors today. Oh, ho, ho! we never had the actual like per other person answer. We've always had the husband answer so far. Oh, that's a bit creepy. All right, one confirmed doppelganger. New job. Okay, so anyone from the floor to uh, room one is definitely a doppelganger because she said that both her husband. Oh, gosh, oh, you're oh, creepy. Oh. You're so creepy. What floor do you live on? There you go. Um, are you on the list? You are on the list. Nacha, Mike, Elis. Nacha. Okay, picture looks good. Picture looks good. F204. Yep. Uh, 586536. Five eight or seven eight nine six seven eight nine six five three six seven eight nine six five three six uh six five four one three six five four one three okay right eye blue okay left eye green curly hair has freckles round face left eye green curly hair yeah, your hair's curly right yeah has freckles yep round face okay you look good your ID is good your appearance is good entry request Resident, come from my job as chef. That is true. You are a chef. And you're on today's list. See? She talked! Ooh, did I freaking mess up? Ooh, did I let a doppelganger in? <laughs> hey! Hey, where's your ID? Oh, you don't have one! <laughs> what is that? <laughs> I didn't study that. You guys are studying? Aw, oh, man. You guys. Oh, man. You guys. You gotta, you gotta get back in the books. You gotta study. What are you doing? Bunch of dummies. And he doesn't have noses for eyes either. I have to go back to school for that one, too. Alright, thank you. Hey, you. Hi. Later, loser. Give me more. More. Oh, you're always creepy. And, oh, you are on the list. I was going to say you aren't on the list. Angus Kipriani. 
Angus Cipriani, it looks good. Angus Cipriani. What floor are you on? F103. You live alone. Okay, good to know. Good to remember. Uh, long neck, wears hat, has mustache. Long neck, wears hat, has mustache. Yep. And small eyes. The eyes are the same. I don't know why. I thought the eyes were not the same. Uh, five six five zero zero three six nine five six five zero zero three six nine eight eight four five eight eight four five. Okay, that looks good. Uh, ID appearance looks good. I'm rest in the building. Come home from my job as a businessman. You are very being truthful with me, and you're on the list. He didn't talk afterwards. Maybe it's because I let them in quickly. <gasps> <laughs> You got a third eye! Oh no! Your eye! Oh, it's looking at me! I saw it look at me! I don't see anything wrong with my ID. I see one little thing wrong with your ID! Ha <laughs> oh. Alright, bye! Creepy lady. Creepy lady with third eye. Hello? Answer your phone. It's an emergency service line. Yes, thank you. What if I let you in? No, you don't care? Okay. Yeah, thank you. Who's next? I want the guy to come back. I want the the wisdom guy to come back. You're not on the list. Oh. What's your entry request? Okay. You forgot. You're not on today's list. Oh yeah, let's see what your wife thinks about that. Your wife should be home. Five two four two five eight. Four two five eight. Is he home? Hello. Raph Dylan speaking. My husband is not at home. Okay, thank you. Is he back? Maybe. I'll have to find out. Okay. So, oh gosh, I have to repin everything. Alright, let's look at this ID of yours. Looks accurate. What about you? Big nose, prominent mustache. Yup and yup. Uses a monocle, wears a hat. Yup and yup. And round face. That is one round face. Uh, oh, get that away from me. Uh, one two zero five four eight zero one two zero five four eight zero nine six three four seven nine six three four seven nineteen sixty, Alf Capuchin. Yeah, that looks good. All right, ID is solid. ID is solid. Appearance is solid. Entry request. Uh, that looks good. Why is your hat missing though? Well, I guess his hat's missing from there. F three zero four. Correct. I'm a resident. Come home with a job as a lawyer. You're telling the truth. You're you're telling the truth. I feel like they need to add more like uh subtle details when it comes to like maybe changing the job up. Cause I feel like we've barely seen that. Like if it messes up on like the entry request, it kinda just is something that's just blatantly like obvious. Where's your excuse me, where's your entry request, bro? Why are you forgetting? This is not my first time seeing you. No reason for you to forget, Mr. Peachman. Robertski. Robertski Peachman. That looks right. Robertski Peachman. F102. Right. Okay. Uh, his. If there's not much you can mess around with his face. Long neck without eyebrows. Big nose has a goatee. Yeah. Long neck without eyebrows. Big nose has a goatee. He looks good. 11465228. 11465228. 9730. 9730. Okay. Uh, ID looks good. Appearance looks good. Entry request. Resident Shoemaker. Resident Shoemaker. Yuppers. Alright, you're not on today's list, though. Yeah, you're not, but bye. He's not talking either. Maybe I put that in my head where, like, they're supposed to talk to you because I swear I thought they did. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I already called in. I went out to visit my parents. That's new. She is a housewife. So there's not much of an excuse, but she's home. 
You can't fool me. She's home. I called that phone number. Right? Yeah. It would it would not answer and be like no one's home. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm not I'm not wrong. I'm not wrong. I'm not wrong. It's fine. Yes, thank you. Thank you, big man. Thank you. Hello? <gasps> it's you! Okay, I actually... Okay, get the video pulled up. I have <laughs> What is the meaning of life in the universe and everything else? 42! Right? <laughs> yes! Okay, what was the next answer? What is the scientific name of the Australian animal that drastically changes its appearance when removed from its natural habitat? This one's difficult. It's such a long name. Okay, something Psy... To go slow on this. CHR. Cycrolute. My goodness. Oh, oh, no. It's still, it's still going with that. Cycrolutes. Mar. Marcidus. Yeah, I, I would totally have known this. Yes, submit. Yes. Okay, what's next? There's a name of the only sport that allows you to punch your opponent in the face because they capture a piece. Chess boxing. Is that a thing? Is chess boxing actually real? That's so funny. Okay. At least how many times do you have to fold a 0.01 millimeter thick sheet of paper to cover the distance between Shire and Mordor? A 38. Sure. Alright. The key is hide What? What? Alright. Uh, Uranus uh, the, this guy put a capital U, so I'm not even No! I put Uranus! Bro couldn't even give me like a little spell check, you know what I'm saying? I I already saw you. Oh, you're immediately it. You don't have an expiration date. You failed. You failed. You're you're bad. Bad guy. Bad guy, bad ID. Next time get a good fake, alright? Give me something that I actually will question. Yep. Thank you, Triple D. My besties. <laughs> Get it? Best D's? Get it? You're my bestie. No? Alright. He didn't like the joke. It's fine. It's fine. Didn't need him. Didn't need him anyways. I like me, myself, and I. Gosh, this guy is so menacing looking, but he also looks so happy. Alright, you are on the list. Uh, floor 3, room 3. Retired McCluey Red Boys. McCluey Red Boys. McCluey Red Boys. Uh, has mustache, big nose, has a goatee. Has mustache, big nose, has a goatee. Uh, smokes, always wears a hat. Smokes, always wears a hat. Cool. Uh, 964516. 964516. 184611. 184611. 58, 55. Alright, your ID and appearance are good. Entry request. Um, a resident building. My apartment is the third room on the third floor honest not really much to go with that and you're on the list <laughs> see you man <laughs> to you too <gasps> i didn't die i didn't die did we do good doppels captured five hi cory neighbors killed Doppels be allowed in zero. Okay, so we did do good. Okay, so the guy who said that he's a public accountant is Wait, what do you mean you're here? Are you in the house? No, you're not in the house. You're just in the stream um, Doppels you kill so public accountant still means accountant Okay Okay, I'm not mad at it. All right, let's try that again. I really want to get that guy back. I freaking spelled Uranus wrong I put Uranus Uranus <laughs> It's not a new job. I've been working here for a while. Big list. Louis Stilnsky? 
Ooh. This will be our first time seeing her if we ever got her. Hey, you're back. Uh, I already know your room. Yeah, we haven't seen her yet. Shoemaker, long neck, out, no eyebrows, big nose, goatee. Long neck, no. Yeah, you're good. Uh, one one four six five two two eight. Uh, nine seven three zero nine seven three zero. Okay. ID looks good. Your looks look good. Robert's key, right? Peach man. Robert's key, peach man. Alright, ID and appearance look good. Entry ID and resident building. Street maker, that's right. You are. Are you on the list? <gasps> You're not on the list. Oh my gosh, I could have let you in. <laughs> not on today's list. <laughs> There's an error. I should be on the list. Let's see what your. Is your brother out? <laughs> Your brother's not out. I get to look at the. I get to call. I get to call. Two, six, six, eight. Is Robert Ski an answer? Are we gonna have another one of those? Hello, Albert Ski speaking. My brother is not at home. Okay, so this guy's good. He's good. He's clear. Bye. He should be good. He should be good. Hello? <gasps> it's oh, you oh, again! Oh, oh. You're on the list! Nice! Good to see you again. Mustache, big nose, goatee. Mustache, no goatee! His goatee's missing! Oh, 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 oh. What's wrong with my appearance? <laughs> yeah, you're, you're looking a little oh, different. Oh, 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 oh. Look carefully at the oh, 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 oh. photos of my papers and compare them well with me. Did you shave? Ah, well, you know, shaving's not allowed here. You make a face and you keep your face. There's no changing or you die. Yes, this man shaved his goatee. Eliminate him. Straight between the eyes. Yep, thank you. Triple D. Thank you, bestie. Thank you. You can leave. We'll go to Starbies later. Have a nice drink. Okay, so we still have McCluey. Haven't knocked anyone out. Ooh. What do I do about you? Where's your ID? Hoon. Where's your appearance? Hoon, hoon, hoon. Oh, he's so creepy. Hoon. Hoon. Should we let him in? I'm gonna let him in. He's the milkman! Oh, he's so creepy. Let's let you in! Bye! He's gonna kill me! <laughs> oh my gosh, he's gonna so kill me. I wanted to let him in! He was so freaking cool! Hey, Gloria. No ID. Yeah, you forgot to show that. And you forgot to show your freaking entry request. All right, all right, all right. Yeah, whatever. We're about to figure this out, lady. All right, you live here. Round face, mole on the right cheek. Yup and yup. Um, short hair, round nose. Short hair, round nose. That looks good, right? Yeah, all that looks good. Gloria Schmidt. Gloria Schmidt and Gloria Schmidt. Okay, F one zero one. Okay. So let's see. Uh, date looks good. Nine six nine eight five two two three six nine eight five two two three four one one five zero four one one five zero. Good. ID and appearance looks good. They check out. Entry request. Resident come home from a job as a banker. That's right. You are. Are you on the list? Yeah, you are on the list. Bye. Say hi to the milkman for me. And the milkman just looks so cool to not deny. Actually, gave me a little bit of a, a little bit of creep. You are on the left, Raftolin Capuchin. Uh, there you are, Raft. That name is spelt so odd. Raftolin Capuchin. Maybe you just juke me out. Raftolin Capuchin. Resident in the building apartment zero one on the third floor. Zero four on the third floor. Yeah, she said that right. Okay, long face, big nose, straight hair, wears a headband. Long face, big nose. Her nose is not that big. I mean, have we seen the other people here? Straight hair, wears a headband. Looks good. All right, your ID and appearance look good. I didn't check the numbers yet. 62. 
five six eight five five four five six eight five five four five nine six three two nine five nine six three two nine yeah that looks good entry request that looks good and you're on the list right you're on the list say hi to the milkman is the milkman gonna eat me is he gonna milk me no he's not no what's going on here another milkman who is this guy he doesn't live anywhere oh <gasps> he does He's just not on the list. Oh, he's a milkman. We've never had this guy before. So someone's already occupying that apartment. Um, so I can't let you in. Plus, plus, you gotta get, you know, something on your eye. Do you not notice that? It's fine. We've never gotten him before. And I probably just killed him. I'm gonna call that room. What happens if I call that room? Yeah, yeah, I want to call that room. Uh, four, one, two, two. This will be our first. Ah. Oh. So there is a milkman that lives on the building. That's fun. Too bad. Come on, let me call. Wait, hold on. You gotta let me see his face first. Four, one, two, two. Four, one, two, two. Oh, I let such a bad milkman in. Hello. Hello, Francis speaking. I'm not expecting any visitors today. <laughs> yeah, he's occupied. Oh boy, I really let a man die. Okay, big nose, scar on right chin. Uh, yeah, and yeah, that. See, that's a big nose. Long face, one eyebrow. Where's a hat? Long face. Yeah, that looks good. Uh, Roman still sky. You're not on the list. <laughs> and leave due to an emergency at work. Yeah, you know, I get those excuses all the time. But let's see what your your wife isn't home. Oh, someone, so no one might answer. <gasps> there he is. My wife is not at home. Yep, but you are. No, she's not back, but he is. Yeah, you're done. You're done, buddy. Dude, just give me like a bomb button. I don't need all this this mess right here. Just give me something to kill him immediately. No shame. No shame in it. Yes, thank you, bestie. Alright, I will. Gosh, they don't walk, you know. They, they, they don't trust me or something because they don't walk facing the other way. Oh, oh, it's you. Where's your freaking thing, girl? Come on, give me that entry request, girl. You know the drill. Are you on the list? Man, there's a lot of big-lipped people on the list, but you, myself, or you, my big-lipped friend, are not on the list. And your husband's home, so let's 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 take a call. One four two five. Is she home? Hello? Yeah, is your wife home? My fiance is not home. Fiance, sorry, my bad. Is she back? Uh, she might be. All right, let's take a look at you. Uh, Long hair, small round nose. That's long hair? Have you seen my hair? Uh, She has freckles, oval face. Freckles, oval face. And thin eyebrows. Looks good to me. Mia Stone. What a s small, sweet name. Mia Stone. F one zero three. Okay. She's a teacher. Seven eight nine five six four two four five. Seven eight nine five six four five two five one one five. Okay. ID and appearance are good. Entry request. Resident building. My apartment is uh, zero one on the third floor. That looks good. You're not on today's <laughs> list. <laughs> Okay. 
Okay. Okay. I know we let one double in for sure. For sure we let one in. Can't even, we can't go. <gasps> we finally get to see her. Oh, we get to see her in all her glory. All right, your name is Louise Stilnsky. Louis Stilnsky, Louis Stilnsky. Oh my, oh my, oh my. Oh, oh my. Roman has a great time. Oh, what is she? She's a housewife. Oh, cool. So we had two housewives on here. Mole on left cheek. That's accurate. Big lips. Oh, yeah. Big lips. Round face, short hair. Round face, short hair. Yeah. Looks good. Uh, eight, nine, four, five, six, nine, seven. Eight, nine, four, five, six, nine, seven. Two, three, six, five, one. Two, three, six, five, one. Cool. Your ID is good. Appearance is good. Entry request. Visit mother. That's okay, I guess. I don't really understand the request reason. At all. Seems like you could put anything on it except like the most suspicious thing. Are you on the list? Uh, you're not on the list, girly. Uh, where, where do you live? There you are. You're not on the list. Mm -hmm. Let's see what your mama has to say about that. One, three, four, six. One, three, four, six. She home? Nacha speaking. I got her daughter in the apartment right now. Great. I'm not expecting any visitors today. I would love to see like a version with visitors added. That would be cool. Like what 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 would you what would you do? Maybe you compare it to like a visitor list. Kind of like the same thing. I would literally just be the guy who sits at the gate of <laughs> gated uh, places. Gated neighborhoods. That's what I am right now, really. Clean protocol is completed. Yes, thank you. Am I gonna die from the milkman? Oh, she lives alone. Yeah, so we officially have seen, I think, everyone now. Did I let one in? Oh. Did I let one in? Oh, I don't remember. I remember that one of them had a missing goatee. Oh, oops. What's the number? 4242. The easiest number and I messed it up. Didn't we let one in? It's not that hard to call. Alright, we didn't let anyone in. McCluey Red Boys. Alright, McCluey Red Boys. Has mustache, big nose, has a goatee. Has mustache, big nose, goatee. Um, smokes, always wear the hat. Smokes, always wear the hat. Okay. Alright, McCluey Red Boys. Uh, 58 looks good. 964516. 964516. 184611. 184611. Give me one that's more difficult, man. I would come from doing shopping. Yeah, you're retired. Doesn't matter. 33. Three, Chloe Red Boys. And you're not on. You are on the list. Solid. You're great. You're grand. <laughs> Have a good in. No blah blah. Got it. Fuck you, man. Hi, Yumi. Welcome in. Oh, Hello. it's you again. <laughs> hey. Yeah, we don't see. Just, just get super glue, and we'll let you in. That's all we're asking for. Super glue on the neck, please. Gosh, she never learns. She never learns. Let's skip that. I wish we could skip this part. Yes, thank you. Thank you, bestie. Yes, much appreciated. Thanks for the sub, Yumi. Uh, hello? <gasps> it's her! She in? She's not in. Where's your freaking entry request? I don't understand why you guys freaking forget. It's not, this is your freaking life, you know? This is where you live. Curly hair, deviated left eye. Yup and yup. Uh, round nose, big smile. Round nose, big smile. Yup and yup. Margaret. Margaret Bubbles. Bubbles. Love that name. F203. I'm in an apartment on the second floor. That is very honest. 
I would forget 50 times a week and we know it. That is true, Anna. <laughs> very, very true with it comes to you. I would just be, like, wanting to go home so bad, I would just have it, like, out. Just, like, take it, please. I just want to go home and sleep. 1032680. Alright, everything looks good. Nothing to really get you. Yeah, I don't. I've, I've never seen that image change. You're good! Bye! Ooh, imagine if, like, you left it open and someone tries shoo, running in. Oh, that would be cool. <gasps> it's you again! I can't let you in this time. You already have someone like you in there. Dude, because I let one milkman in, they sent me like three more. Triple D. Clean profile is completed. Thank you. Alright, I will. Ooh. Ooh. Hey, it's you. Okay, so this guy, okay, he's on the list. Three zero three. Big nose, worst glasses, short hair, small head. Big nose, worst glasses, short hair, small head. Yeah, that looks right. Sixty six. Stephen Red Boys. Stephen Red Boys. And then S two three three. Stephen Red Boys. Yeah, that looks good. Five six five eight four five four five six five eight four five four five five nine six five 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 nine six five. Easy. All right. ID appearance looks solid. Our entry request come from your job as a pilot, dude. You're solid, solid as a rock. Not in your pants, though. I hope not. That's a bit, a bit weird. Enjoy your time with your dad, grandpa, with your with your family member. Oh, oh, <laughs> those aren't lips. Those aren't lips! <laughs> Woo! Hey, your appearances! You can't freaking talk, dude! You have too big of teeth! How do you brush those? It must take you fi freaking 50 minutes to brush your teeth. Are you Illinois, by the way, or are you Celine? You're Celine, too. You're not on the list. <laughs> huh? Huh? Alright, have a good one. <laughs> Yeah, holy teeth, exactly, flowers, what the freak? Dude, imagine, you keep them brushed. But I can see that, that's model quality. All right. <laughs> All right. Thank you, I'll continue my job. Trying to brush that would be a nightmare, right? Especially flossing too. You have to go all the way, that's an arm workout. Did I check you in today? Dude, when these days go on for too long, I start forgetting everything. I'm gonna have to call this number, because I forgot. <laughs> five, five, one, three. I gotta make sure I didn't. Let's see, did I let you in? No, okay, that makes my life easier, but your ID, come on, man. This isn't, this isn't new, this isn't new. Um, Angus Cipriani. Angus Cipriani. Long neck. Where's a hat? Has a mustache. Small eyes. Long neck. I don't, I don't think that's an average neck. Has a mustache. Where's a hat? Small eyes. That looks good. Couldn't tell if you let him in or not. I just got here. Yeah, uh, I don't, I didn't. So that's good. Businessman. Job. Alright, good. F103. Good. Alright. So your entry request... Your appearance looks good. Let's check those ID numbers that I've never seen change ever in my life. 565-00369. Five, 565-00369. Six, five, zero, zero, um, looks good. Alright. And you're on the list, right? You're on the list, right? You are. Okay. Have a good in. <laughs> Bye. Hope you don't see the milkman. Uh, thank you, Withered, for the follow. <laughs> Illinois. She's the one that isn't in. Yeah, okay. Illinois Seversht. That's a freaking name I never remember. Seversht. That looks right. Okay, uh, 1980, good. She's a model, F104. Accurate. Illinois Seversht. Alright, let's check that appearance. Mole on left cheek. Okay, yeah. 
Uh, small pointed nose, slim, long neck, has a twin. I don't know why that's part of her appearance. Long point, uh, pointed nose, long neck, slim. Oh, maybe we have to look at this. Will they, like, get larger on the body? Is that why they say that? At least this one doesn't have a face with teeth. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> she's actually, she's actually normal. She's actually human. 8453230, 8453230, 1, 4, 2, 9, 5, 6. Uh, one, four, nine, four, six. All right, you're good. Don't really need to to. Ooh, there we go. Bye. Am I gonna die? I'm waiting for the milkman to kill me. <laughs> I'm waiting for those hands. <gasps> oh! <laughs> what are you, a frog? You're a frog. <laughs> those eyes are a little different. Oh, what the? You can see into my future with those kind of eyes. Ugh, frog eyes, goat eyes, whatever you call them. Just, ugh. Oh yeah, thank you. Thank you. See, what would I do without you, man? I would be dead without you. I'm still waiting for one time he's just gonna, like, uncover his head and it's just gonna be, like, a clone of me or a clone of the- <gasps> I did die! <laughs> It had no reason to scare me. The milkman got me. Doppel's captured eight. Neighbors killed zero. Yeah, I let the milkman in. Ghost face. That's funny. Oh. Yeah, that was expected. Ooh, that got me too. I freaking knew I was going to die too, but it still got me. <laughs> so once again, I had a perfect day and a normal day. All right, I'll leave it uh, there then, and we'll move on to some other games. Times I survived four, times killed two, neighbors killed one, doppels you loud in, and we captured 37 so far, almost, almost to the 50 mark. All right, so I got a couple. We've already. I want to do crow scare. Crow scare. If we, if you all have been here, um, I know Anna has. I think with the. That's not my. It's not me. It's my basement. That's a good one. And this is the same creators of that. We already played Point Click Killer. I need to uninstall those. So, we are going to... Let's see. We're going to uh, do Uno Lingo first. <laughs> I didn't set up my freaking scary wheel to just choose one for me. Because um, I woke up a little too late. But we're going to do Uno Lingo. Don't forget to practice. I used to do Duolingo for like Spanish to help me with my Spanish class, but uh, I haven't I haven't messed with it yet. So maybe I'm out to do it and I get killed. I love good face of tea. <laughs> uh, let's go in. Hi, it's Uno. Looks like you missed your Spanish lesson again. Hey there, you've missed your Spanish lesson yet again. All right. Yeah, I've been busy. Can you leave me alone? <laughs> Oh, I'm sorry for if I'm bothering you with your learning goals. Well, you are. Okay, I'm tired of this. See you soon. Oh. What does that even mean? <laughs> We're gonna freaking die. I'm sorry. I'll do it right now. Biblioteca. Biblioteca. Hello. What am I? <gasps> there we go. <laughs> Hello. Hola. Hey. Oh, he just walking in. No, no, no consent whatsoever. Oh, it's gonna have me tied down. Oh! Ah, my head. How did I get here? Uh, oh! Oh, you know what would have been so funny if we had like the Spanish questions then? Oh my gosh, I'm so short. Holy cow, I'm short. Hey, what's that? What's that? That's paper. Can I open this? No. Ooh. A uh, font. Why am I rotating when I do that? 
fine. Oh, it is actually a Spanish thing! Encuentra your lesson in the abyss. Okay, lesson, uh, lesión in, which is N, L, uh, where is it, where is it, where is it? Abismo. How do I get to the other, how do I? Hello? <gasps> Or miss your family as much as you missed my streaks. Oh, why does she talk like that? Is Uno Lingo a like femme? Ooh, is this a door? What am I supposed to do? Mine? How do I? I need like a key or something. Okay, so don't step on the teddy bears. God, oh my gosh, they're everywhere. Okay. Oh, don't step on it. Can I look through any of this? No. Oh, paper! To whoever finds this, I don't have much time. The Unolingo bird has captured me. I fear I may never escape it cl its clutches. It's been days since I was taken, and I've been trying to outsmart that relentless bird every turn. At first, I thought it was just trying to teach me a new language, but now I'm not so sure. There's something more sinister at play here. I can feel it in my bones. The bird's lessons have become increasingly difficult, almost as if it's preparing me for something. But for what? I don't know. But I refuse to give up hope. I've managed to find a key card to the exit, hidden in... Oh, it's in my cell where that pesky bird won't find it. I just need to buy my time. Wait for the right moment and make my escape. If you're reading this... Know that I haven't given up. I'll find my way out of here no matter what it takes. Alright, Jenny! Alright! Okay. We're still fine. Oh, what is that console? I also need to do something real quick. Uh, what is this game called? Uno Lingo? I doubt. Oh, it is! On. <laughs> I'm putting it on Switch. Okay. E. Do not. St I'm assuming I'm like a small child to not be able to step on any of this. There's nothing back here. Correct sentence is required. Okay. Is this for the um <gasps> Ah Okay, so we need to just memorize the thing. But there's no abyss here, is it? Uh uh Gares, let's see on question. None of is there wait, there's a next button? <gasps> no! no! <laughs> <laughs> okay, I get it. It shouldn't scare me that hard, though. I watched you. I waited for you to finish your lesson, and you never did. I'm sorry. Two days remaining. Oh my gosh, is this like freaking Granny? Oh man. Okay, I get it. So it's a Granny thing. Got it. I need to. Chill out. Your family seems nice. It would be a shame if they started missing their lessons, too. You talk too loud, girl. Alright. So, yeah, this all saved. So, I, you know what? I'm just gonna... Where's my phone? I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna take a... Yeah, there was no abismo in it. Am I supposed to figure that out? Oh boy. Alright. Let's go. Got evidence. Okay. Let's double check this. If not, I'm just gonna move on. Alright. 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 Okay. 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 Um... There's, there, there, no, we need encuentra. Sentence is, okay, so maybe we need to find a different sentence. None of that is actually accurate to the little turnstiles. 
Alright, let's go this way where she was at. Okay. Alright. What's in here? <laughs> no! Wait! Oh my gosh! Wait, 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 wait! Adway, Adway, Adway! You're talking to me! I need to go, I need to go, I need to go, I need to go. <gasps> Why are you there? You're not chasing me? What are you two being? Uh, in here, in here, in here, in here, in here. Okay, so she's slow. Is that what it is? She's just slow? Okay. What? What is this room? What? Green. Can I just... Excuse me. Eh, excuse me. There's no paper here or anything. Oh, okay. Blue. All right. <gasps> what is this? Oh, here we go. Agada da por las de la. Okay, so these are the two wrong words. Let me just. Uh, let me just. Uh, all right. Uh. Okay. 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 I'm assuming he can't fit- no, he can fit through these rooms. Uh, let's see. This is just blue. Mistakes are the gateway to our realm. Okay! At least you're honest! Oh, ain't no way. Can I- excuse me, Mr. Piggy. I thought we no. were friends. No, no, no. Friends. Oh, what friends? Miss language lesson. Okay, 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 okay. Do we follow? I'm, I'm just gonna follow. I'm hoping she doesn't, she's not one of the ones that just turns around on a dime for no reason at all. Alright. I'm. <laughs> you do turn around on a dime, you freaking butthole! You stupid no. butthole! Green bird butt booty! Close the door! Oh, 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 you know, the, the stuffies don't help. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. What was in that room? Did we ever go in that room? Shoot, I forgot. We're back here! Great. All right. All right. I don't know Spanish. Come on, man. Okay. So the first word is agarada. Uh, poor. La Maybe it's not loss because that would mean it would have to be. She's stomping. Oh, yeah, there's got us. It's not got us. What's I got at that? I don't. De la. I need to. I need to figure out. I need to. Dude, where's my. Where, where, where's. Where's my. I need to. <laughs> I need to open up Duolingo. A tra uh, Google Translate. Enter text. All right. I got out of grabbed by what? What's, what's sequestrar? Sequestrar. Caught for kidnapping? Okay, well, that's not it. Ooh, what if it's like caught for missing a lesson? What's uh. App last star for crushing? Think he's coming back? I hear him. He's freaking behind me. But I don't think he goes in these rooms unless like we really like signal it. Pajaro, caught by bird? Ooh, that could be it.
caught by uh day it's not day oh my gosh what is this what is what is, so it, hold on where's the photo 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 so it's agra agarado or and then de la and it's not and it's not got us what's got us claws so it's not caught by the claws of obsession is that yeah that's obsession okay uh okay so what if it's caught by bird of the lesson <laughs> Every lesson you miss, I get a step closer. Do you really want to see what happens when I reach you? Okay, so it's not, it's not that. I need to close this door. Okay, what does that say over there? What does that say? Employee of Eternity? Okay. What's in this room? I don't think we've been here. Okay, 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 okay. We're in a new room. Okay, we're in a new room. Find your lesson in the abyss. Encuentra tu... Okay, I knew that. Wait, maybe... Maybe I should just... If this is all crossed out, maybe I should just, uh, do the crossed out ones. Whoa, ease. Hold on. Oh, 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 wait. Hold on. Freaking I, Q and E, like, auto-rotate you. It's stressful. Can I even get around this way? I'm not even gonna try it. <laughs> okay, so that was answers to that one. So that doesn't help our situation right now. Can I look out the window? Alright, let's try, let's try, let's try what, what the actual thing said. Okay. The picture had, uh, agrada por las garas de la session. That was right. Oh my gosh. Okay. I should have just done that first. You know, coulda, woulda, shoulda. But now we're here. Okay, now where is she? I don't hear any footsteps. What, should I wait? Okay, okay. No, 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 we're fine. We're fine, we're fine, we're fine, we're fine. I got a notification that my Mew Crafty stuff comes on Friday. Nice! My chair is coming on Friday. Friday will be a big day. Okay, so your is do please, please that sounds so loud please don't do that please don't do that all right key card now we just leave is that it is this for freedom i don't know what to do i don't want to die at this end we'll just try okay we wait is she gonna go She's just gonna turn around. She's so gonna just turn around. All right, we wait. We're waiting. We're waiting. We're waiting. We're waiting. Cause I don't think she goes in the rooms and like chills in there. Hello. <gasps> Dude, I hate how she randomly just turns around. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, okay, okay. Now's our time, now's our time, now's our time. Now's our time, now's our time, now's our time. Freedom! Freedom! What? 
New lessons? Oh wait, no! Oh! Oh, yay! That was so fun. <laughs> that was a great game. Short and sweet, and it was grandma style. I appreciate that. I appreciate that so much. I should just freaking looked at the picture first. All right, sweet. Uh, so that was Uno Lingo. <laughs> That was really freaking cool. So now let's hit up and do. Gosh, I don't know. Um, let's do VHS Paradise. I feel like this game's gonna give me the freaking creeps. You're Robert, the cashier from the VHS Parad Paradise. Your job is to serve customers on the night shift. But be careful, there's a lot of crime in the city and all kinds of crazy people on the loose. <laughs> Great, three endings. I sincerely hope you enjoyed the game. If you have any feedback, okay. All right, well, you know, there's nothing else I can do but play it. All right, see ya, Yumi. Thanks for joining in. Okay, VHS Paradise. Did not update you stupid thing. There we go. All right, the VHS Paradise. Here we freaking go. I am eager, eager. Yay! Oh, oh, we just plop in. Oh, okay. Are those eyes looking at me, or are those the stars? Those are the stars. Hello. Good gosh, this game is a little, a little loud for me. I'm terrified already. All right, we got some nice tapes. Wow. Wow. Yeah. I so know all these. Hey, is that Indiana Jones? Yeah. Yeah, movies. Yeah. Okay, can't go back there. Maybe that's a good thing, you know. Blocks off how much I can really get myself killed in. All right, paper. Hi, Robert. Hope you are well. I hate this dang fever, but I'm recovering. Okay. Hello. Remember to start your shift by turning on the computer. I've left a good movie for you to watch when you finish your work. By the way, I heard that the rate of thieves increased at the at lost at oh, oh my gosh. I heard that at the rate dude. By the way, I heard that the rate of thieves increased a lot in the city and much more at nighttime. Of course. Uh, pay attention to what each customer is doing. If you see one leaving without paying, run to stop him. Be very careful. This isn't safe at all! Th isn't it a thing where, like, you freaking just... Isn't it a thing where you just, um... Where companies actually fire you if you go and try to intervene? <sighs> oh my gosh. Are you kidding me? You have to stop thieves? This is not paradise. Start shift? Sure. They're gonna kill me. I feel like I'm just gonna get kidnapped. Hello! Wow. Hey! Welcome to VHS Paradise! What do you want? Hello, boy. Do you have the movie Dune here? <laughs> Hello, ma'am. That movie is currently in the cinema. It's not on VHS stores. Ah, oh, I don't like the cinema. I'll have to wait then. Come here in a couple weeks. We may have that movie on sale by then. I understand. Thank you very much. Bye bye. Better not take anything. All right. Easy. Good job. We're doing good. Hello. Check my corners. Oh, here we go. Another customer. Hey, what are you doing? Hey yo. Hey yo. Okay, alright, alright, alright. I see you. I, I, I see- I, I see you holding that! You better come pay! You son of a- You better get back here! Get back here! Give me my tape back! G no, I'm slow! Wait, no, no! 
Hide, 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 hide. Don't come in! Aw, oh, dang it. Alright, that's it. I'm camping. I'm camping out. Hey, what are you doing, huh? Looking at tapes? Huh? We're, we're, we have you on camera. You're on TV. Smile. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hey, I'm in my protected bubble. Yeah? You gonna pay for that? Pay for it. Better not run. You're normal. Got it. How you doing? Hello, friend. I want to buy this movie. It's twenty dollar. Excellent. Finally. Finally what? I have finally reached a hundred movies purchased. I love collecting these wonders. Do you even watch these movies? No, I don't see them. I buy them to de just to decorate my house. You know what? That's valid. All right. Are you gonna pay or what? All right. We're we're in a hole. Ah yes. Take it. Thank you very much. Is it fake? Where's the light to scan the money? Huh? Alright, one, one DVD stolen. But you know, what am I to do? I feel like I'm gonna get chased down and like get kidnapped. Like that's that's gonna be the, the thing that's gonna end up happening and I'm gonna get scared and I'm gonna die. Hey, how you doing? Looking at movies? Yeah, we have a great selection. What's wrong with your neck? Ooh. I'm watching you. Hey, you get back here! My movie! This movie is for my little niece. Please. Forgive him and let him go? No! It's just a movie! To jail, you rotten! To jail, I say! Whoop whoop! You're gone. Ah. I love my job. <laughs> Alright. Are we gonna get any girl thieves? Hey, how you doing? Find anything good? Oh, yeah, you did. You you have a suit, that means you, you have money, right? You got money. Yeah, you got money. Alright, alright. I'll, I'll help you with this purchase, sir. Hello. Good night, sir. I'm taking this film for one day. Here is the two data. After a bad day, there's nothing better than spending the night to watch a good movie at home. What happened? Why do I care? I was fired due to downsizing. I worked in an office. Oh, I'm sorry. Sorry to hear that. Do you did you like that job? No, my boss was an idiot. Good thing all about all this is while I took while I look for another job, I'll have time to meditate and for myself. I understand. Luckily, my boss is a good person. He tries to encourage me to be happy with this job, uh, but he still doesn't succeed. Very often, I have to deal with this very strange people and also with thieves. It's horrible, but unfortunately, I have to continue with this job because I have to pay for my studies. All right, we're just you know airing out dirty laundry right now. Yes, lately the city is very insecure. There's a lot of crime and many crazy people on the loose. You have to take care of yourself. Well, I hope that soon the work situation will improve for both of us. You just have to be optimistic. Bye-bye! Thank you very much. Have a nice day. Yeah, bye! Enjoy the movie! Alright. That was good. That was good. No thieving here. I'll watch. I'll watch bye. We will, we will, we will be stalkers of the night. Hey, yo. Be stalkers. Find a movie that you like? <gasps> you did. Ooh. Hey, I had the door blocked. <gasps> you paying for it. Oh, I love people like you. Normal citizens, you know what I'm saying? Normal citizens. Naughty rabbits in a sexy adventure? <laughs> you know what? Everyone has their preferences. Do you want to buy or rent it? I want to buy it. Okay, $20. Here's the money. I'm surprised you're the only cashier who doesn't look at me with disgust or rejection when he sees that I want to buy a movie like that. Well, you didn't see the real me. Truth is that I don't give a dang. You can go now. I also like the movie. The scenes are very exciting. Sorry, but I'm not allowed to chat with customers. I have to close the shop now. I don't have time to say to talk to you. Thank you very much for your purchase. Literally, a lot of them are just dismissive. Um, I also like this movie. I have to close the shop now. I don't have to stay. I don't have time to stay and talk to you. None of, all these are so dismissive. Um, I don't know. I want to be nice. They're exciting. That's right. My name is Kyle. What's your name? Robert. Nice to meet you. Can I ask you a question? Sure. Are you happy in this job? Do you fulfill your dreams here? Why do you ask that? 
curious. No, the truth is I'm not happy. It was never in my plans to work in a VHS store. My boss does everything he can to make me have a good time here, but the truth is, is that it doesn't work. Makes me very sad to hear that. Well, it was nice meeting you, Robert. Hope to see you soon. So, bye. Alright, weird conversation. But, you know. Being nice is always key, and I didn't want to be a douche to him. So does that really mean- is my shift actually over? It is! Well, my shift is over. Now let's watch the movie that John left me. I'm dead. I thought the mechanic had fixed that alarm problem, but apparently not. Hope John's movie doesn't disappoint me. Alright. 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 Okay, maybe we're actually fine. Gosh, those noises. Close shop and watch the movie? Yeah! Is it gonna be good? Is it gonna be the wild rabbits? What a mediocre movie. I've never seen such a predictable ending. I wonder what John saw in this uh saw in this to recommend it to me. I better go home. I'm tired of being here. I'm tired. <gasps> Oh, is he like the last guy I talked to? Game by FedEx. Is that it? Oh man. <laughs> okay, so let's. Uh, I want to get the other endings then. That was quick. So I guess since we said we liked watching it and the scenes were exciting, the kidnapper, which I'm assuming is him, heard it. And was like, oh, okay, yeah, yeah, all right, yeah. Let's let's be, I don't know, dismissive. Oh, I don't know. All right, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Sorry, 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 sorry. Yeah, thank you. Okay, uh, yes. <sighs> all right, so let's. I don't know. We could be a dick and we could be dismissive. Um. So I I guess we'll we'll be dismissive maybe. Also different people. Hello. Found a movie that you like? What'd you get? Oh, that's very nice. Yes, good movie. Good. Oh, you're gonna pay for it. Okay. All right. All right. How you doing? Can I take in this film? Oh, okay. So they come at different intervals. Interesting. See ya. Oh, this is where we were. Dude, it's nice down here. What? Okay, someone's coming, someone's coming, someone's coming. So maybe I could have escaped? Oh, I don't know. We'll see, we'll see. But the escape... Okay, so he was behind me, and I would just have to, like, beeline to the left. Got it. Oh, interesting. Hello? How you doing? I don't remember you buying a movie. You a thief? Were you the first thief? Where you going? Huh? Where you going? Yeah? Trying to find that one movie that you want to steal? You thief! I'll be following you. I'm watching you. Have fun trying to run away. But I'm right behind you. You better pay for that. You better pay for that. Wait, are you actually gonna pay for it? Wait a minute, you're actually new. Hello, I'm taking this movie for one day. Two dollars, right? Hello, yes. Well, I'm new to this city, you know? It's pretty, but I've heard there's a lot of crime. Yes, be careful. Did you move here, or are you on vacation? I'm moving here with my husband. We hope everything goes well. Oh, I understand. Well, I have to go. Good night. Goodbye. Good luck. 
Take care. Ooh. She's new. I right, have a good in. So there are different customers. And there's gonna be that one rabbit movie guy. Forcing me to watch sexy rabbit time. You're new too. Hold on, we're getting a lot of females in this one. Hey. Hey girl. Hey girl, how you doing? Finding the seventh season of Friends? Huh? It's over here. Gonna pick it? Sex in the City? It's a great movie. Don't steal. I'm right here. You son of a- Please, it's my son's birthday. He's seven years old and wants to have this movie very much, but I have no money. Have mercy. No! It's just a movie. It's just for one hour. Avery is wrong! Whoop whoop! Get her! Whoa, whoa. Okay. Who are you? Huh? Who are you? I don't know if I've seen you before. Yeah, we're trying to watch Jaws. E.T. Scooby-Doo. Two. The kidnapper was kind of like a bunny, too. So it had to be like him. Stealing? You son of a- Dude, I'm employed and in debt. I just want to watch a movie in peace, please. Uh, no. Go, like, meditate. Go do something else. Go outside. Go for a walk. I don't care. I don't care. Avery is wrong. Give your pity stories to the judge. Oh, is this him? I think this is the guy. This is the kidnapper. Yep, it is. All right. All right, Robert. If that's your real name. Yeah, you just find it immediately. You know where it is. Okay, so we're going to be dismissive. Hey. Rabbits in a sexy breakfast. Yep. Yep. Bye. $20. Here's money. Okay, so this, I think, defines... I have to close the shop. I don't have to stay and talk to you. Sorry about not allowed to talk with customers. We're gonna put I'm sorry not allowed to chat with customers. Uh, sorry. Enjoy the movie, bye. Oh. What happens if you're saying yes? I guess we'll just let thieves go. Maybe I could do that in one last run. Unless I just watch it on. Okay. Yes. Is he gonna be behind me? Mediocre movie. <gasps> He's not. He's not behind me. Oh. Oh, I don't like this. Oh shoot, I don't like this. Oh. Got stopped behind a bus, that's normal. I don't like it. Do we live? You arrived home safely! Yeah! Okay, so we just didn't, like, we, we, we'd have to, like, not talk to him. Alright, I'm gonna try one more time and find the other ending. And this time I'm gonna let all the people who steal go with it. And then maybe be like really give the meanest response to the guy and see what happens. I don't know if much will change, but we'll see. All right, that was good. So lesson learned: do not talk to anyone. <laughs> don't talk to anyone. Don't 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 feed into their conversations because they can be creep stealers like you. You're new. You're new. How you, how you doing? How you doing? Can I leave? No. How you doing? Hmm? Movie? I'm shopping with you. I'm your buddy. It's me, your friend. Gosh, what's going on under that hair? Yeah? You like it? Hey, where are you going? Don't touch me, butthole. Call the police if you want. I don't care. Wow, you're the perfect person I would love to do this to. I forgive you. Okay. 
Didn't seem like it did much. One computer's already enough noise. Alright. Microwave. It's her again! Okay. I'll just wait here! Alright. Yep, yep, yep. Let me move in. Uh, be safe! Don't answer any questions about a bunny movie! Can I find that movie myself? No, it doesn't look like it. Gosh, I swear these are like real movies. They're just like super pixelated to where you can't tell. I can't, I can't tell at all. Hello? Oh, it's the guy who uh, lost his job. Mm. Oh, I thought that was another person coming in. I was like, twofer! Oh, he found one. I'm just like, ah, oh, yes, this movie, so nice. Uh, yep, 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 yep. So we get two thieves, and then the rest are nice people. Not bad. Like this one looks so familiar, but I can't tell. Hello? Man, you can't decide what you want to get. Man, I miss Blockbuster so much. Blockbuster used to be a cool place. I used to get the best of candies there. Are you new? Or I forgot about you. Oh, he's the collection guy. Alright, yeah, take care. Hmm. These are on, like, Blu-ray. They got that little Blu-ray thing on them. And why are they taking it out of the box? Just bring the box with it. Are you gonna teeve? You look like a teever. You're a teeth. Thief! <laughs> Alright. Oh, your parents don't want to lend you money? Whatever. So you think stealing's the right thing to do. Got it. Is this Robert? Why do I keep calling him Robert? Is your name actually Robert? It is though. Wait, is it? No, that's not him, is it? He's taking a minute to decide if it is. It's never been his motive. He always knew what movie he wanted to watch. Yeah, no, it might be him. Is it him? It is! Okay. Uh. One. Oh, he didn't like it. Oh, he was silent. Oh, he's gonna kill me. Oh, he's gonna kill me. Yep, there goes my car. Oh. Did my car mess up last time? I don't remember. Oh, he's gonna kill me! <laughs> yep, there he is. Run, 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 run. No! Go, 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 go. Go, go, go. Oh, what's gonna happen? What? The brakes won't work! You died in a traffic accident? What? Oh my gosh! So you either get kidnapped and forced to watch the movie, or you he messes up and breaks your brakes, and you die in a car accident, or you live and you just like, just Stay indifferent. Say, like, I'm sorry, gotta go, bro. Like, wish I could talk, but, you know, shift's over. Oh, man! That was so good! Holy cow! That was really, really good! Oh, man. Alright, sweet. That was VHS Paradise. 
Oh, that guy was creepy. Yeah, look at his face. Look at a little bunny man. Ooh. Ooh. That was fun. Um, okay. What other game can I suffer? I want to try this game. This game is called Feed Live. Um, Feed Live is a short puzzle game taking place in an unusual live streaming app. You, I stand alone... It's a standalone sequel to Feed Vid. The games can be played in any order as the stories aren't directly... Wait, how bad is... Wait. Well, let's try it and we'll see. I'm not really great with puzzles. <laughs> but we'll see. Uh, no, 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 no. Where'd the game go? The game contains... Might be distressing. Headphones are recommended. I need to do window cam. Oh, it's like a phone thing, too. Interesting. Is that... Is it not going to fit to screen? Well, that's the best I'm going to make it. Stargate username! My goodness. Showing you my login, login and everything. Age... 23... Whoa, Epic Jake cries on stream, mental breakdown. Angel Ava at the gym. Oh, gaming, ga gamma gamer swatted. Oh boy, Mr. Johnster destroys keyboard, rage quit. Creepy man stalks kitty during stream. What the frick is this? Addressing the drama? Hot tub stream, relaxing ASMR. Oh, is this the one we're supposed to watch? Can I type? Hey yo! <laughs> I can't! This is so weird! What the? What? It's so pixelated! Oh, plus one viewer. Oh my gosh, imagine if a noise happened like that. I just clicked. What is this? IDK man. <laughs> Not sure, it looks like a live stream from a bathroom stall. Poop stream. Is there breathing? Did anyone else randomly get gifted a sub? What? So what exactly are we looking at? Toilet! It's a, dr it's a bathroom stall with a toilet door and a drain. Um, okay. The lid is shut? What is what's going on? Are we supposed are we just deducing what's happening? Dude, he's get this guy's just getting viewers for streaming a toilet in the dark. Green toilet. Oh, green. Oh, I know what we're doing. So what if I type open lid? He opens it. Oh. Screwdriver. So yeah, he listens to our command. Damn, that's gross, bro. <laughs> Drain. Yeah, interesting. So we put the drain screwdriver with the drain. And the chat kind of gives us hints. <gasps> Key. Interesting. Uh, why don't we type drain again? Like, cover the lid. No. Alright, so then let's head to the door. 106 viewers! That's crazy! Key. Oh. Now this is content pockets. <laughs> oh, weird. Oh, sink? There was a sink. See another stall and a urinal. ACM. Stall? Can I look back in chat just in case? Oh, cool! Like they clip a screenshot with for us too. R L O. R L O. Oh, another 
the screenshot taken, thank you. Urinal? Dude, this is interesting. I love this. The breathing is sucking. Alright, someone take a screenshot. Come on now. Yeah, take a screenshot. XPX, thank you. Behind. Oh, door. What? Oh, I see, I see, I see, I see, I see, I see. Okay, okay. Now, now it's solving. So, M. M is O. Then we have C. Then we have, like, some weird line. U. This could be, like, a cult. I think it's gonna be, like, a cult. No, there's no T yet. And V. A oculi. Dude, this is so crazy! It's so scary! Just got raided by Carl J. LMAO. <laughs> uh, what? Body? That is a body. That is a body. What are we doing? Hand? Okay, locker. So we got drawing door, drawing door, body, locker. Okay, and that needs a code. Alright, let's head over to drawing. Oh, what? Door? This, I'm so, this puzzle game is weird. Right, each row column, both diagonals have the same sum. Looks like a door opens with a hand scan. Dude, this is so confusing. 20k people are watching this. Is it 32312? I don't know. Guess not. I think I see something in math. Magic squares? What the frick is magic squares? Right, each row of columns, both diagonals have the same sum. Each row column. So what? This is thirteen. What? This makes no sense. This makes no sense to me. How would it equal out to thirteen? Nine to get thirteen would be five. To me, this is so okay. So oh, I get it. So they all have to equal out to something. So is this freaking math? Well, 13. I'm going with 13. Can we make it all 13? So this would need 6. 13 would be 8. No, 7. 7. Yeah, I think it's 13, 12. Okay, so what if we do 1? And then what was this? 9, 1, 5, 7? No. Oh, I don't know. He's not putting in the numbers I'm asking. Chat, stop talking. So now I'm stressed out. Oh, actually, this is our answer. 14. It's 14. Because the all the diagonals have to equal. And so 2 plus is... No, it's 15. Duh. Oh my gosh, my brain. So 8 plus 4 is 12. So it's... Okay, so... So it has to equal out to 15. So it's three 
right? 12, 3, and then 1, 6, 59. No, let's do this one. 9, 6, 9. Is it 3, 6, 9? 3, 6, 9! Isn't that part of Three, six, nine, da, 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 Breaking my brain? <laughs> yeah, this is awful. Door. Holy crap, bro. 70k, 75k. This would be a fun stream in real life, though. Like, wait until someone gets the right answer for it. And. This is the biggest stream on the site right now. Yeah, I bet. Are we moving? Oh, we are. Oh, I don't like it. Hello? What? What? It's too pixelated! Ah! Oh, snap. Is this the other one? Ooh, this one's scary looking. This one does not have a chat, it looks like. 
He visits a short puzzle place, taking an unusual video sharing app. If you get stuck, please try the game hints menu. Oh, interesting. We won't do that one. Because I feel like I'll be actually stupid. Alright, so let's play... I think this will be um, our last random games. And then we're going to hit up uh, Kindman Remedy. Because I definitely want to complete that. So let's try Crow Scare. I don't know if it's fully scary. It's got scare in the name, so we'll do it. Game takes one and one and a half hours to complete. There are two bad endings and one good true ending. It is a short horror game. Okay. Yeah, we'll do it. Um... Oh, you guys can't see it. Properties. There you go. Yeah. Because last time we played It's Not Me, It's My Basement, and that was really good. This game contains themes and depictions of the following. Blood and gore, implied child abuse, extreme violence toward child characters, implied potential child death. Discretion is advised. Space to continue. You've been warned. Yes. That's all I need you to do right now. Oh, whoa, she's pretty. Pick out the biggest pumpkins in the southeast patch. Chase away all the birds and check on Haley. After that, come talk to me again and figure out what to do next. Oh yeah? And what are you gonna do, Dad? Dad? Mm, I'm gonna sit here and rest. I have to save my energy for the harvest festival after all. Come on, you can even spare a little magic for me? Just this once? Sorry, Rio. You know I have to save my energy. I spent all, it all helping with the farm. I have none left for the harvest festival. But you're my little champion. You can handle it, right? Unless... Huh? No, yeah. I am the champion. I can totally do it. I've done it before. You can count on me, Dad. I'll do it lightning fast. Faster than you can cast any of your spells. <laughs> I thought so. If you need any help remembering what to do, just come back and ask me. Or, you know, you could write it down in that journal I got you. I haven't seen you use it since I gave it to you. Why would I write it down when I have you right here? Alright, alright, fair. Either way, I'll be waiting right here. Yeah, I didn't think you'd be moving very far, but I'll get it done now. Good boy, I have another chore for you after, so don't forget to come back to me once you're done. Got it! Okay, scaring the birds. Arrow keys, space, or enter X to open the menu. Okay. Hello? Did we mess with her? Oh no, Haley! Have the birds been picking out all your straw again? Don't worry, I'll fix you up. Better. Oh, Haley, you're not very good. Scarecrow, are you? Hmm. What else do I have to do? Haley smiles warmly at you. Is Haley alive? So what, are we messing with the crops too? Or no? Any pumpkin not ready to be picked yet. I know we have to scare birds away. Oh, I love the music. Oh my gosh, my freaking face is looking gosh awful. Can I, is there, is there, can I? That's just making it worse, isn't it? Good gosh, it's just so orange. Alright, let's continue. Birdies! Get out of here! Get out of my property! Ah, gotcha! Oh, it's capture them. Boo! You don't scare me, kid. Whoa, you can talk? Yeah, what about it? Oh, nothing. I mean, I've met plenty of talking birds before. I just... Why are you hanging around my farm acting all shady? That's kind of weird, isn't it? Look, kid. I'm trying to help you. Something bad is coming. Huh? What is? Looking forward to the harvest festival, right? Yeah, why? Someone wants to ruin it for you worse than you can imagine. But I think if you're careful, you can make sure it turns out okay. Uh, Alright. Why are you telling me this, though? Because kids like you are the ones who need better, a better understanding of dangerous situations. True. But hell, even some adults can't recognize that some birds are too big to scare. You're just a little bird. Shut up! <laughs> but keep your eye out, kid. Stay away from the forest, alright? Hopefully this is the only time we'll need to speak. So be careful, you don't have to see me again. Okay, so stay away from the forest. Excuse me, this is my house, not yours. Well, that's all the birds. Is there anything else I have to do? Is there? Stay away from the forest. Uh, water? Bucket of resting water. The bugs love it. I don't think there's anything else for me to do. Okay. Don't even think about trying to jump in. 
That's the forest, I'm assuming. I'm not gonna mess with that. So all itty bitty pumpkins. I'm just gonna talk to Dada. Papa! Papa, I'm done! Is that all? Pick out the biggest pumpkins in the southeast patch, chase away all the birds, check on Haley. Then come back to me when you're all done. Oh, but I couldn't get around the pumpkin patch. Maybe I just need to go the other way. Like, yeah, like over here. Yeah, okay, so this one. Sizable pumpkin. Whoa, you're perfectly round. But everyone's gonna be fighting over you. Pumpkin, you make a great jack-o'-lantern. Or a great pumpkin pie. So are we actually scarecrows or are we dressed up as them? Look at you. I would have trouble lifting you if I wasn't so strong. And then... Orange pumpkins are always the best ones. Don't tell the other pumpkins I said that, though. Those look like all the biggest pumpkins in the patch. Do we have anything left to do? Actually, I think that's it. I should go tell Dad I'm all done. Alright, easy enough. Papa, I finished all the chores, and who is Haley? And why do we treat her like she's human when she's not? Dad, Dad, I finished everything. Already? You're so fast. I knew I could count on you. What do you need me to do now? Here. Package some mini pumpkins for you to bring to the library. They want you to, they want to decorate the window sills with them. You know how to get there, right? Of course I do. It's the green building close to Main Street's entrance. Green building, Main Street's entrance. They got all the yellow pumpkins in front row. That's right. Such a smart boy, Rio. Of course I'm smart. I can take care of the whole farm by myself. <laughs> Don't get ahead of yourself. You still get tangled in the house every now and again. Well, that's just because uh, I'm small. But I'll deliver these pumpkins lickety-split. Tell the librarians I said hi. Alright, so... Down? Is it down? I'm swing down. Oh, that's me. Okay. Oh, this town looks so freaking pretty. It's the doctor! The statue dedicated to the goddess Luciana. Luciana is the goddess of nature. Harvest night, her chalice is said to fill itself with moonlight. In return for such a wonderful drink, Luciana grants a plentiful harvest season for everyone. It's almost like your day, Luciana. Can't wait to be able to celebrate the harvest festival with you. I bet moonlight tastes delicious. These two are always up to something. <laughs> Didn't our character have stuffies of these from um, it's not me, it's my basement? Hey, it's the doctor. Oh, he's got like uh, stuff painted, leaves painted on him instead of flowers. It's so lovely to be here during the autumn. Positively delightful. Oh, that's so cool. Embry! <gasps> Is that her? Oh, hi, Rio. Nice outfit. You look, what's it called? Sharp. Haha, <laughs> thank you. I picked it out myself. You've got great taste, Mrs. Oliver. Haha, <laughs> thank you. Hello there, Rio. How's your father doing? He's good. We're preparing for the harvest festival. Is that why you guys are in town? No, we're just passing through, but since the festival is happening, we're probably going to stay in town for a few days. Well, I see your mom and Dr. D. Where's Dad at? Uh, Dad is looking for someone who can fix the cart. It broke down as soon as we entered town. But at least we all have the festival to look forward to while we wait for it to get fixed. Yeah! But even when there isn't a festival, you guys should stop into town more. I miss you when you aren't here. I miss you too, Rio. Maybe one day we can travel together. Oh, without us. We miss you too, you know. Gee, Embry, how come you two, you get to have three parents? I'm just lucky, I guess. Yeah, really lucky. Uh, Rio, did you say something? Oh, no, no, just thinking to myself. I'll see you guys at the festival. Have a great rest of your day. Three parents? Maybe that isn't the girl then. Who's over here? These guys look talkable. Nectorary. Hi, Rio. Oh, she's cute. Rio, yeah, it's so good to see you out and about. Hello, Miss Mafuma. I like your sweater. Thank you. You're such a sweetheart. Rio, Rio, we were just about to get dinner. Do you want to come with? You're always welcome to join us, you know. That sounds nice, but um, I'm running chores for Dad right now. Maybe next time. Aw, he can't just do it himself. Oh, I want you to come eat with us. No, not during the harvest festival season. Dad, uh... I can't walk. Wait, for reals? I thought you knew. That's why he's always floating when you see him. I thought he just did that for fun. Nope, he uses some weird levitation magic to get around. Something like that. But, 
whenever the Harvest Festival rolls around, he saves up all his magic energy to make fireworks show for everyone. He doesn't move around much to save up uh, as much magic as possible. And that's where I come in. I always help him so he doesn't gotta strain himself or nothing. Oh, that makes sense, I think. But we'll still get to play together during the Harvest Festival, right? Yeah, of course. I'm really excited. It's actually gonna be my first one. No way, really? Don't you like live here? How come you never went to one before? Isn't it like a yearly thing? I remember coming here for the festival before we were friends. It is. I, um, always in bed by sunset. Huh? It does seem a little early. I know, but farm work is tiring. Plus, Dad says nighttime can be dangerous. But he's also been saying that he thinks I'm strong enough to handle any dangers at night now. So I'm really excited to be outside during the nighttime and for the Harvest Festival, too. It's gonna be a blast. In that case, I can't wait to see you there. Bed early because of monsters? Friendly scarecrow with a dapper apparel. Do these guys matter? No, it doesn't look like it. Alright. In the library. Thank you again, Rio. No problem. That's it, right? We, that's all we had to do? We can go home now? It was nice to chat with people. This guy looks so pretty. I can't wait until I can watch the entire sunset. It truly is a sight to behold. After the Harvest Festival is over, you can sit here and watch it with me every evening if you like. That sounds nice. Do I really have to wait until the Harvest Festival though? Can't I just watch the whole sunset with you right now? I just think the night of the Harvest Festival will make it all the more special. And I want your life to be full of as many special memories as possible, don't you? Yeah, I guess so. How was your trip into town today? The library liked the pumpkins. Oh yeah, they love them. Oh, and you'll never guess. I saw both Embry and Nectarary today. Really now? How wonderful. Tell me about it. Um, Embry, I was with her mom and Dr. D. Oh. Ooh, he said with their mom. My bad. That totally, in, uh, if I remember, it's not me, it's my basement. The person was non-binary, I believe. Um, so that could be, that could be them. That could be, oh, that's a cool little like little teaser, not teaser, but like little Easter egg. There you go. Oh, how is their mother doing? That's funny. She has the same thing about you. Haha, <laughs> how kind. Anyway, they were passing through town, but their cart broke down. But while it's getting fixed, they're gonna stay in town for the festival. That's wonderful. Well, not that their cart broke, I suppose. But I'm happy you'll be able to spend time with them again. Yeah, Embry's so cool. I love when they're in town. And Nectarary. Oh, yeah, yeah. She was out with her mom, too. They invited me to dinner, but I told them you needed help here. Oh, you didn't have to do that. I would have let you go with them. You're good about getting home on time. I know, but I like eating dinner with you, too, Dad. That's sweet. You're a sweet kid. Um, Dad? Can I ask you something? Of course. Seeing everyone out with their moms today. Just wondering. Are you ever going to tell me about Mom? Rio, we've discussed this before, haven't we? You don't have a mom. I made you from straw, magic, and a lock of my hair. Oh, so he is a scarecrow. Like, actually. Why, the only difference between you and Haley over there is that you can talk. That's what you always say. Do you really think I believe that? Everyone may call you powerful. Even I don't think you can pull off magic like that. I never, 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 ever heard anyone bring someone to life through magic. <laughs> you think I can't do it? If you can, then show me. I want to see you do it. Uh, no thanks. One kid is enough for me. <laughs> um, is there anything else you need done before the sun is finished setting? Mm, well, I do need some mushrooms for a potion I want to make. But they all grow, only grow in the forest. I'll get them myself tomorrow. Huh? But Dad, what about your magic? I thought you needed to save the energy. Huh, <laughs> I could spare a little to go into the woods for an hour. I can get them for you. That way you don't have to worry about it. No, no, I don't want you to. The woods are dangerous, you know. There's rumors of an evil witch who lives there. I hear she eats children. Haha, <laughs> yeah, right. I bet that evil witch uh, people talk is... Ugh. I bet that witch, evil witch people talk is about you is just you. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Don't make jokes like that, Rio. Uh, sorry, Dad, I didn't mean it. 
don't like that with no jokes. Really, don't worry about it. I can get them tomorrow. It's fine. Okay. And, and, I love you. Oh, I love you too, Dad. It's almost time for bed now. Why don't we go inside? I'll have another, I'll have other stuff for you to do tomorrow. Let's get you to bed on time, and I'll see you in the morning. All right. Easy, peaceful day. No force. I thought we were going to go in the forest in a second. Dad's asleep. I could totally go get those mushrooms. No! Dad's been saying to himself that I've grown up strong enough to handle any dangerous things at night. I bet he'll be extra impressed by me if I show him that I can go get the mushrooms on my own. And he won't have to waste any of the, his magic either. The forest is right next to the house, so even if I get a little lost, I don't think I'll be too far from home. Now all I need is a lantern. I don't know a lot about the night, but I do know it gets dark. Real dark, apparently. But whenever Dad needs to see something in the dark area, he takes out an old lantern to keep things light. He even taught me how to use it. And it should be over. Ah, there we go. Now all I gotta do is get out really quietly. No, we're gonna die! Whoa. This is the night? It feels so weird. If it's night, then that up there must be the moon. Oh, that's pretty. Whoa! Huh? Ah! What, what is this? My hands! This thread! What happened to me? Dad, Dad, he was really telling the truth, huh? He knew that if I went out at night, I'd see that I really am a scarecrow. But I, I don't understand. Dad, he always told me I was a scarecrow even when I didn't believe it. When I thought he was just kidding. So, if this was never really meant to be a secret, why was I never allowed to go out at night? It's weird. I feel so different and yet, it still somehow feels like myself. What am I waiting around for then? I'll go get those mushrooms. Uh, no you won't. You'll go back inside. You don't have to go inside right now. I want to. I don't want to go in the forest. Oh, you're forcing me. You're forcing my hand. I was told not to go in the forest by two different people, and you're still forcing me. What happens if I go in and immediately try to go out? And now, now leave. You can't go back yet. You need to get those mushrooms. Dang it! Hey, kid. You stupid? Hey, it's you again. What are you doing here? Ain't it past your bedtime? Yeah, how'd you know? You should go back home. That witch they talk about. She ain't no joke. Oh, yeah? Just go home, kid. I will. I just gotta get some mushrooms for my dad first. Better get him quickly, then. We can't go back? Oh, no. Huh? What was that noise? Oh. That was me? I didn't even feel it. I'm really just strong, then, huh? I see. Must be why I wasn't allowed out. This tear was any bigger, my whole leg might empty out. No, 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 it's okay. Dad was going to start letting me go out at night for the Harvest Festival anyways. So then he must be- th He must think I'm big enough to take care of myself. I won't be scared by some little scratch. I'll, uh, I'll just shove the straw back in, cover it up with some mud. Then sew it back up once I get home. Yeah, that'll work. I can handle things at night, and like this. Even Dad thinks so, right? No, not the forest, dude! Alright, let's read this. Don't wander too far. Yeah, we're, we're staying on the path. I don't... Where's the mushrooms? The woods are dangerous. Beware the witch who lives here. <laughs> Alright, three things telling us. An old backpack lies on the ground. The inside is empty. The trap's broken. I guess they didn't think it was worth fixing. But you're not even gonna take it back home with you? Oh, man. Mushrooms. Mushrooms. Ooh, there's a fence up there. We're not going up there. I bet that's where the witch lives. Alright, let's go across. Don't stay in the woods too long. She's outside more than you think. No way! Oh, what's that down there? Beware the witch. Don't try to reverse in the woods alone. Oh, the bird! Are you following me? <laughs> no. Why would I do that? I don't know, man. You 
kind of acted like you were worried about me before. <laughs> You're imagining things if I if that's what you think. Why are you here then? I'm not. Think right now. <laughs> He's funny. This bird looks like it is trying to protect me. Which is why I tread carefully. Oh no! Oh no! Danger switch lives past this point. Best to turn back. Good. We are. Where are these mushrooms? I see no mushrooms! Something wicked this way lives here. Oh. Just a bush? Is this a mushroom? No, it's a giant rock. Alright, let's not cut corners. But wasn't there like... We were... Hmm. Yeah, there's a sweater down there. It looks like a sweater. I want to see what's up with that. Can I? No, I have to like go all the way around. Yeah, over here? Can I? Yeah, there we go. Half of my shirt lies here. Looks like it's been torn. This reminds me when I read my shirt climbing up a tree. But I'm sure this is here for a similar reason. Uh, doubt. There's no, there's no mushrooms here. What? Plus, I'm not technically a child. I am just Scarecrow. So maybe that will, you know, be a bonus to her not eating me. There's a path this way. Unless it leads to nothing. Leads to nothing. What are these? Just pebbles? There's no mushrooms here. I'm wasting my time. Do I really have to go to the witch's place? Um, like, what's up with this tree? These trees look weird. Mm, I don't know. Maybe I do have to go past it. Do, can I? No. So where are these freaking mushrooms? I could scour everywhere I could. Oh, those boots? I didn't see these. Pair of old boots lays in the grass as if whoever was wearing them was plucked right out. How does that happen? Walking around a forest without shoes would hurt, wouldn't it? And we're still looking around. Okay. Oh, what's this? Finally! Looks like you found your the mushrooms. Looks like you found them before I did. We kind of just went looking together, you know? Can you just take your mushrooms and go home already? Damn, please! Got him! That wasn't so hard at all. Ah! What was that? Sounded like a tree fell. Well, I got what I needed. I'll just go home then. Oh, did the bridge break? Did the bridge break out? Ooh, I think the bridge fell. She knows. She knows we're here. We're so dead. Is it up here? Where is it? It should be up here. Oh no! Yep, there it goes! That noise? The trunk fell? How am I supposed to get back home now? <gasps> now what's this? Who, who was that? Is it her? Yup! Her! Oh, she's pretty. A little scarecrow boy. That's new. But please don't eat me. I'm nothing but straw. And he can't go back the way he came through. No path to return to. In cases like these, I think a bridge will do. Oh. Don't trust her, though. There you go. Or maybe it's because she can't eat me. Or is the bridge a trap? <gasps> it's not a trap. Dad's gonna be pissed at us. <sighs> good morning, Dad. Good morning, son. Oh, good news. Huh? Turns out I don't have to go looking for mushrooms today after all. When I was checking through the cabinets today, I saw something right in front. I was certain we had to run out, but I suppose I was just overlooking things. 
Oh, yeah. Silly, Dad. You're just, you weren't looking hard enough. <laughs> they are the mushrooms you needed, too, right? Yep, I've got everything I need. See? I told you you didn't have to worry about it. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, what do you need me to do today? I want you to make hay bales of the small piles of hay in the northwest field. Chase away some more birds and check on Haley again. You can do that, right? stupid what you did last night, kid. Hey, it's you again. Do you have a death wish? Are you talking about the witch? Is that who, wanted to, is that who you wanted to warn me about the other day? Because you didn't. You need to. She, she was nice to me. She helped me get back home. That's because you didn't have anything she wanted. Huh? You were only straw fa and fabric. No use in killing a stupid scarecrow. That's true. She only eats huge, like people. It seems like not really anything else. And if we're made out of straw, or are we like made out of like normal during the day, and then at night we come out as a scarecrow? I wonder. I don't know how that works. Either way, Haley's pissed at us. I would be pissed at us too. again. I I have to thank her for helping me yesterday. If she can come into town, then I have to go to her. It'll be okay, just like yesterday. She found she pre she found me pretty easily, so she can't live too far, right? Uh, you're an idiot. Can we Oh my gosh. Can we check on her? Is she going to be mad at us? His face is sunken. She almost looks like she's frowning. Yeah, I would be frowning too. I'm a scarecrow. <laughs> Life will be easier as a scarecrow, Anna. Uh, oh, there it is again. See you again. Didn't I tell you to stay home? Heh, <laughs> you're not my dad. Yeah? And what would your dad say if he saw you doing this? Okay, so he said that, our dad said that the, the witch can turn into crows. And that's what's told. So what if... I don't know how I'm so tired. But what if the um she is actually this crow right now? 
And she is just wanting us to go away because we're a scarecrow. She can't do anything with us. So maybe that's why? Because this crow says that he's going to help us. But what if we go against him? Scarecrows don't have chronic pain. I feel that. Yeah. <laughs> Scarecrows are easier in life. Yeah, that's what I thought. I'm already outside. Just want to thank her for yesterday. That's all. If you had just stayed home, this wouldn't even be an issue. Well, what about you then? Doesn't seem like you're ever home at night. Shh. Whatever. You're not going to listen to me anyways, right? Fine. Go on ahead. See if I care. But don't say that I didn't warn you. He said that she turns into a crow. So unless it's like a different crow. It's this way, right? Yeah, it has to be. I'm sure I'll make it there soon. There's a letter here. Oh, he actually is going to her house. Huh? What's this? I hate you. I hate you, I hate you, I hate you. I hope you die, and I hope it's because they kill you. Jeez, what's that all about? Uh, just normal hate mail. You know, you post anything on Instagram, usually get something close to that. The fire will not burn our bridges. The fire will bring them together. Uh, the fire will not burn our bridges. Yeah, 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 yeah. Then this is our house. Light torch? Why are we doing this? Alright. Like that one. Like that one. Nope. Got it. That one. That one. That one. There we go. And that's her bridge. Another bridge! The witch really must love bridges. <laughs> A bridge witch! Uh, bridge? A uh, witch? No, neither of those sound right. <laughs> yeah, a britch. That's what she is. Uh, hello? Oh. Oh, here we are. Home sweet home. What are we doing? This is so stupid. Oh. The little scarecrow boy from the other night. How did you get here? I followed the signs that said, don't go here. The witch lives up ahead. <laughs> those silly little things. I never bothered to take them down. I have no idea who puts those there. But yes, I suppose that's me. I am a witch. I suppose that's why I don't get in many visitors. Well, except for you, it seems. What about you, little scarecrow boy? I've never met anyone like you before. What are you doing here? Oh, that's because I have something for you. What's this? A flower for me? How sweet. What is this for? For helping me get home the other day. I would have been stuck in the woods if it wasn't for you. Ha <laughs> I see. Thank you very much. Though it is quite late for a visit. Do you always come out at night? Do your mom and dad know you're out here? Oh, uh, my dad doesn't know. I would get in trouble if he did. And your mom? <laughs> I don't have a mom. I see. Would you like one? Uh, what is this Coraline thing? I don't need a mommy, bro. No, no. I like my dad, okay? Huh? I apologize. That must sound so sudden. It's just, I've been alone out here for so long. Why, I can't even remember the last time I saw another person. And it's just, just, forgive me if I appear a bit emotional. It's just, I had a child once, but children don't stay children forever. That child grew up, and he left me here on my own. Ever since I've been well, having a bit of an empty nest syndrome, they say. Your generosity and your kind smile, it just reminds me so much of my own little one. So I wouldn't mind if you wanted to come back again. Why would you come visit me every night? Oh, why? You could come visit me every night if you could. I can make extra dinner to share, and you can help me cook, or read in my library, or play in the yard. It would be like having my little one back home again. Do you like that idea? <gasps> would I? Yeah, I really like that idea. Wonderful. Well then, let me ask you one last thing. What is your name? Oh, I'm Rio. What about you? I'm Venna, but you can call me Mom. Okay, this kid is so impressionable. Dear Journal, Dad got you for me a while ago, but I never used you. It's not that I didn't want to, just didn't have anything exciting to be writing about. But now I do! The witch that people say that lives in the woods? I met her, 
And well, she's my mom now. During the day, I help on the farm and spend time with dad. But when it's night... I mean, that's cute though. It's cute but dangerous. I sneak out into the woods and visit mom. I really like it. I help her around the house like I do at the farm, but it doesn't feel like a chore. She always has new stuff to find. Like the first time I went out there, I found... Whoa. Well, here's the inside. Please forgive the mess I'm not used to. Well, any company at all. Had I known I'd be having a guest, I would have tidied up a bit. I think it looks great in here. Reminds me of home. Well, I'm happy to hear it. Here, I'll prepare some snacks for us. Feel free to look around. Um, you can eat, correct? Being made of straw and all? Um, I think so. Never really tried it yet. <laughs> right. I guess we'll see. Make yourself at home. potato what game is this this game is called um it's the one that also made it's not me it's my basement this game's called crow scare what is this old sack of hay why do you have hay there's a crow a painting of a crow uh this door is different from the color from the rest yes that was my old son's room the door broke one day and I, we had to replace it bloodwood gives it such a nice red color does it not i'd let you in I lost the key myself a long time ago. But there's nothing important in there anymore. So it's not a big deal. Hmm. Hmm. I don't trust her. That's an old storage room. I let you look inside, but I don't want you to get hurt. I have a lot to, of garden tools and heavy furniture. I like to clean it out before I let you in, if that's alright. I let you look, but honestly, there isn't much to look at. Just my bed, really. Well, then let me in. I want to ex examine my new mom's house. Got a full ordinary household items. And this one in particular seems to be full of bathroom supplies. Ah, the potty. A stout bathroom sink rusting in front of the dusty mirror. Both the cold and warm water run fine. Box. Okay. Cabinet. What's with all these scratches? Oh, bathtub. We're just not making note of any of these scratches. Okay. Uh, anything in here? Old oh, like, okay. What if we leave? Is leaving an option here? Oh, that's my cauldron! It can be used to brew potions and other things, but lately I just use it to make soup for dinner. <laughs> I'm sure a lady who eats human kids. cabinets. That's cool. Nothing useful. I mean, she's doing it. Might as well follow the steps with her, right? Uh, nothing. 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 Alright, let's check out her library and then we'll dip. Maybe we can go home. She's a pretty witch, but she's still a witch. Tall bookshelf of books. These books seem to be about spells, potions, and similar magical things. is powerful tool uh, that should not be overlooked. There's so much, there's so much in words. There's power in words. But power is not all. There's sadness in words. There's joy in words. There's fear in words. There's comfort in words. There's sadness in the voice of my beloved telling me their feelings have vanished. There's joy in the cards I received for my birthday reminding me how much of my friends care for me. There's fear in the sign that tells me, danger, beware. And yet I always find comfort That's a hatch. What's this? I found a big pile of hay sacks sitting in front of something on the floor. I wanted to get a closer look, but before I could, I heard Mom say, Rio, I finished preparing everything. Come sit with me. Oh, I'll be right there. So I went to go eat with her. Oh, ooh, apples. 
Well, I hope you like apples. They're in season right now, so I have a lot stored up. Wow, these taste delicious. Thank you, uh... M Mom? <laughs> Sorry, I'm not used to saying that. I'm sure. I know it's certainly been a while since I heard it. It feels nice. All my friends have moms, you know? And I never thought one day I'd get to have one of my own. I understand I never thought I'd be able to have a child again. And yet, here we are. <laughs> you know, I should introduce you to Dad, too. But, uh, I had to figure out a way to do it without letting him know I snuck out at night. He always told me the night uh, time could be really dangerous. But look at me now, out at night and totally fine. Your father is right to be concerned, you know. There are many dangerous things in the night, and even more so out in the woods. Really? Then why do you live here? Because she is the danger. She's the danger. Because I'm stronger than all of them combined. Really? You must be super powerful witch then. Haha, <laughs> you flatter me. But I don't think so. I'm strong enough to handle the things that go bump in the night. But not as strong as I like to be. How strong do you want to be? Because, like, my dad's a pretty strong witch too. He brought me to life after all. I can see that. If you want, I can ask him how he did it. Then I could tell you, and you could get as strong as he is. Haha, <laughs> that's sweet, but I think I'll be okay. I have my own plan to get strong, and it won't be too much longer before I can see it through. If you say so, I guess. But if you change your mind later, let me know. Haha, <laughs> will do. Oh, she's suspicious. I sat and finished the rest of the apples with her, and then I went home. She said she'd try to be more prepared for my next visit. Next time I visit her, I asked her about... Whoa. Ugh, oh, that didn't work either. I'll never be able to make this potion. Sure you can. It isn't that hard. Why don't you try again? If you're feeling confused, you can always ask me for help. Okay? Alright, let's leave. Escape! You don't have to leave right now. She seems innocent. I think it's a trick. Because we always... Because we got signs saying that she's evil... And now she's being nice. I don't know. Hall of Haysax. I can't. Ugh, I want to go into that freaking thing. It won't let me. Mm. And then I still can't. No. All right. Dang. Okay. So we need to figure out what potion is. Do I have to read these things? It's a bookshelf full of books. I'm just. My name is Ingram. 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 Someone has written their name multiple times over. My yellow book of rest It's a journal. Oh. Okay, so the ones with the yellow book seems like it has stuff in it. So I, right now I see that there's three books actually. Okay. Just gonna check to see if we, because we're still missing a key. That's so how many of these wicker journal line space written is writing here. A B C D E F G. JKLMP, Oh, they're practicing their writing. Yellow Vivid seems to be written over and over in a variety of different ways. They're definitely practicing their writing. Whoever it is. The witch, maybe? Hmm. Alright, nothing. No key. No key. No folded over rug piece. Here's the other journal. Brown fox jumps over the lazy dog. The quick brown fox, fox jumps over the lazy dog. The quick brown fox jumps over the lazy dog. Yeah, they're just practicing their lighting or writing. I'm just repeating the sentence over and over again. This book, because doesn't it um, have all the things in it, all the letters in it of the alphabet? Oh wait, this chair here. Chair. Can I push this chair? No. Oh, I can use that chair for the cabinet. No. That's her name. And there's no, there's no change here. There's nothing you need in there, Rio. Come back and finish a potion. I'm sure you can do it. Alright. In Graham. Still don't get it. What order do I put the ingredients in? Haha. <laughs> it really isn't complicated. You just have to remember a few simple steps. It's hemlock root before cobwebs. Cobwebs come before water lily. Hemlock root 
does not come after brown caps. You know what this sounds like? It sounds like I'm about to take a picture. Alright, thank you. Hemlock root also is before brimstone, and brimstone comes before cobwebs and water lily. And of course, you need to put this little thing before everything else. Alright, why can't you just give me the order like a normal human? See? That's not too hard to remember, is it? Uh, kinda. Alright, so here we go. Let's remember. What ingredients? We need to put in... It says thistle comes before everything else. Thistle. What ingredient will you put in next? Okay, hemlock root is before brimstone. Brimstone. Okay, so hemlock... It's hemlock root before cobwebs. Cobwebs before hemlock. Hemlock root does not. It comes after brown caps. So, for, so it's brown caps. Next. And then hemlock. And then... It's hemlock root before cobwebs. Oh my gosh. Okay, brimstone comes before... Okay, so now it's brimstone. Oh gosh. Brimstone. And then... Cobwebs and then water lily. Did I do it? Hey, I think I did it! Let's go. See? Told you it was easy. You'll be an expert potion maker in no time, just like your mother. <laughs> you think so? I made some potions with dad in the past, but he always let me he only let me make really specific stuff. I think he doesn't think I'm ready for the more advanced stuff yet. How silly. At this rate, you'll be an expert in no time. Come over here now. Help me with the potatoes for dinner. I hope you don't mind that dinner has only been fruit and vegetables lately. It's hard getting good meat out here. And usually I try to preserve what I can for a special occasion. Yeah, because you eat children. Because that's what they tell you to do. They tell us that you eat children, you child eater. I don't mind. I actually like salads and stuff a lot. Wow, how did you find out what a salad is if this is your first time trying food with her? I want to try this recipe. <laughs> yeah, it sounds delicious. Uh, Vin, I mean, Mom? Yes? Can I ask you something? Of course, go ahead. There's a lot of scarecrows back in town. I was told it was to keep you away. Mm-hmm. But I'm a scarecrow. Do I, like, hurt you or something? Oh, no, dear. It's true that the scarecrows keep me away. But you're just one little scarecrow. And such a polite one, too. With a smile only someone as cute as you could pull off. You're nothing I can't handle. But the amount of scarecrows in your town... My, it's just nauseating. Feels like every home must have one or two sitting outside. I can't stay around that many scarecrows for so long. I'd get terribly sick. I'd collapse. I see. Don't give me that look. Like I said, I can handle a little scarecrow like you. But I want you to be able to see everyone in town, too. I'm sorry, Rio, but I think it's clear they don't want people like me there. Crows? Crows. I felt really bad about that. Sure, the townspeople would like Mom if they got to know her. Maybe I can convince them to take all the scarecrows down. And they see she's not bad at all. She even saved me from the nightmare I had. Journal. I'm not sure if I should write about it. I hear that writing things down can make you remember them better. Something happened last night. I had a nightmare, I think. I don't know what else it could have been. Even Mom said it must have been sleepwalking. But it felt so real and so scary. I can't stop thinking about it, even after she told me it wasn't real. It all started last night. I was getting ready to come back home and sleep until morning like I always do, but... It's raining? Oh my, sounds like quite a heavy storm. Mama! Wow, you're already hitting her with the mama. Mama, what do I do? Scarecrows get all soppy in the rain. How am I gonna get home? Well, I'm not sure if you can in that case. You can stay here, though, if you need to. I cleaned out the storage room to remove anything dangerous. There's an old bed in there, too. But what about my dad? I'm always in the bed in the morning. If he sees I'm not home, he's gonna freak out. I'll get in so much trouble. Hmm, I see. How does this sound, then? Sleep here for tonight, and before the sun rises, I'll come and wake you. Then you can run along home before your dad wakes up. Does that sound okay to you? Um, uh, I guess so. You promised to wake me up on time? I promise. And you also tuck me in? Haha, <laughs> of course! 
Mom took me into the storage room. It was a bit cramped and there wasn't any windows, but there was a bed there and it felt warm and cozy. She told me she would come back to wake me up in the morning. Then she left and I went to bed. And then it started. <coughs> oh, huh? Oh shoot, my lantern. But that scream, who was that? Mom? Uh-oh. It's in shadow, you don't want to get too close to the broken glass. The crate has a large crack in it. Seems like you can open it with your bare hands. Oh, it seems like you can't. Maybe if you could pry it open. Oh. Is that a le There's a letter. There's a piece of paper on the ground. She found my old writing. She hid them from me, so I can't look at them anymore. She warned me not to do it again. Joke's on you, old hag. You are smarter than you think. Oh, that so a kid was practicing the writing and all that. My name is Ingrid. My name is Ingrid. So she captured someone named Ingrid. He looks different from before. He looks different from before. Can I pull it? Okay. Oh. <gasps> Her room. Mom, where are you? It's really dark out, but at least the rain stopped. I don't think I can get around from the moonlight alone. I need a lantern. Oh. What? A lock chest with a pretty golden trim. You have no idea what could be inside. Bed, it's empty. Okay. Book lies on top of the dresser. It reads, The world can be the way you wish it to be if you wish for it strongly enough. However, it never turns, it never hurts to ask for a little outside help. Feed your wishes to the gods and they will feed you in return. Huh. Okay. Uh, nothing special there. So I need a lantern? There is a, a trap door in the library. I might have to go there. But there's nothing here. What if I try to go outside? Nope. Alright, I need a lantern. Isn't Dad gonna know our lantern's broken then? Hello? Nope, trap door is still fine. Oh, hey, Zach. Yeah, that's why the writing here is Ingrid. Ingram. Ingram. Instagram. Yep. That was her old writing. Can we go in the room? The door is locked. Okay. What are we supposed to do then? Not, there's not much to do. We went to her room, we went to my room. I can't. There's not really much I can pick up. I mean, what can I do with this? Can't even light that. There's nothing in here, right? No. Potion? Empty? Sack? There's nothing here. What am I supposed to be doing? nothing in this couch. I can't look in this couch. I can't squeeze past anything. What if we go back to bed? Dang, I can't believe we messed that up. I don't have an inventory, do I? I don't think I have an inventory. Oh, isn't it X or something? Yeah, I don't have any items. Mm. There's nothing different. Where am I supposed to be going? I don't got a lantern. 
Mom is gone. Is it wobbly leg? Can I do anything to like interact in a different manner? Oh, they both are wobbly. What? What? There's nothing here. I didn't mess with the bathroom much. Is there any difference in the bathroom? Run the water. <gasps> Six four two eight. Oh, we put hot water on. Oh, is this a knife? I could take it with me, but I guess I'll be careful. Oh, I see. Okay. So six four two eight. Six four two eight. That means we can go in the... Oh, that means we can go in the thing. Can I use it for this crate? Mm, uh... No, it doesn't look like it. And her thing wasn't a number thing, was it? It wasn't numbers, right? I have to double check that. No. 246... Shoot, I already forgot the code. 2468? Right? 2468. 2468. 6428. 6428. Okay, so we have to go in the basement. There we go. 6428. 6428. 6428. 6428. There's a truck going on the floor here. I wonder where it goes. So we can't get blocked. Oh, wait. There's spots to input numbers. 6428. here. Painting is so lifelike, it feels like its eyes are following you around the room. <gasps> Cause they are! Look at that! Oh, you looking at me! You looking at me! Oh, you're creepy! Right, let's break all these. Get all oh, there's a journal in that bookshelf too. Okay, alright. What's in here? Bookshelf. Have titles, you can't pronounce the words. The insides are so different. Okay, so these are different language books. Bright yellow book. Press the top shelf. Opening it up seems like a more like a journal. It's writing in here. Library, library, library. Miss B works at the library. Miss B is a librarian. Miss B teaches kids how to read and write. I wish Miss B was my mom. Miss B. Miss B. That's interesting. Can we break that painting, please? Creepy. Oh, now that's a potion room. Well, let's look in this room, too. This is- that's a mess room. Wait, maybe we should go in this one. This one has, like, notes. Good gosh, what a maze. <gasps> that had blood! It's a piece of paper on the ground. No one is safe traveling in the woods. Not as long as she is here. They are all doomed the moment they set foot in the forest. Instead of signs to warn them, I don't know if she knows I'm the one who's doing it. Even with the warnings, it's still too late for some of them. I at least find solace in believing their ghosts will haunt her forever. Oh, more blood! Is it all blood? No. Oh, there's a crate back there. I saw it. Oh, what are these guts? Child guts? Human guts? Oh, man. A ladder. Oh, where can I use this? You can use that on top of the um oil. No, if you're getting dreams like this, she is evil! Ain't no way we're staying here anymore. Is there any more notes? No, nothing there. Oh, there's a door. Door is something inside. Whoa, a crowbar. It's kind of small, though. I can use this anywhere. Okay, so we can definitely use these upstairs. The crowbar is definitely for the book. Um, the crowbar is definitely for the crate in our bedroom. And then the... The other thing is for the bookshelf that has the oil on top of it. At least we're getting somewhere. Now we're getting into the juicy details. Alright, what's in here? Cauldron swirls something red. It smells terrible. Ugh, even dad's worst potions don't smell this bad. What kind of potion is this? Blood. 
She also feels strange, magical vials, looks familiar to dad's stuff back home, and yet you never see some of the things. Yeah, because she's evil. Okay, just making, let's just double check all these. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh my gosh. Okay. 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 Yeah, all right. Is this door locked? The door is locked. Looking closer, there's a small text on the door. It reads, do you have the time? Oh, we don't have the time. Okay, uh, nope, that wasn't it. Ooh, so we have to find, maybe the crate has the hands to the clock? I don't know, but let's go take care of the two things that we know we can do. We could put a ladder here. Wait, I can use the ladder here. Yes, sir. Lamp oil, now I just need to find a lantern to go with it. Oh, that was lamp oil. Okay, so now let's find the a crate. Where is she? She's somewhere. Right, let's see inside. What are these things? Are these clock hands? Then these must go. We take them here! Is it gonna just automatically like put it to the right spot? Grandpa's like, hey grandpa, I got something for you. Clock magically moves themselves into place. Time reads 1205. 1205, 1205, 1205. Gosh, you can't move a little bit quicker? 1205, 1205. 1205, 1205, 1205. 1205, 1205. Door's locked, look closer. I do. No! One. Oh my gosh, I keep hitting his face thinking it's gonna make me next. Okay. No! Oh my gosh, okay. Let's go slower. Tap, tap, tap. One. Two. There we go. Door unlocks. <gasps> e. E. All right. What's this? It's a book on the dresser. It seems to be some kind of recipe book. It reads twenty-six seventy-eight bones, nineteen and a half gallons. What do you need? Two hundred and seventy. What? Measures about thirteen in total, but you can always add more and drink whatever is left over. Alright, what's this? Shelves feel strange. It looks so, okay. Okay. No, 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 no. Chair. Lantern! Now I can use the lantern, then I'll uh, go look for the outside. <gasps> it's so bright. Oh, someone was there! It's closer to the chair, even though you don't recall seeing it in the room before. Oh! Oh! That's creepy. There's gonna be any more shadows when we leave? <gasps> Oh, something about the painting seems different from before. Maybe you just couldn't see it in the dark? Is anything different here before we leave? I doubt, because this is more like maze like. It doesn't really seem like much would change, but still. Does it hurt to check? Does it hurt to check? And it's fine. Ooh, but the painting changed, and there's some sort of ghost here. So these ghosts must be haunting her because they, uh, they killed her. Ate her. Or she killed them and ate them! Nothing in here. Would the door be magically unlocked for the boys' room? Let's see. Nope. Dang it. I try. What about her room? Nothing different. Dang. Okay. Yeah, let's just head outside. Seems like nothing else has changed. Mm -hmm. It's okay. Don't freak yourself out. It's gonna be fine. Mom said herself that she was strong enough to handle anything out in the woods. So I'm sure she's okay. Let's go. Oh! Little Red Riding Hood! Ah! Rio? Ah! Rio, what's wrong? Are you alright? There's, there's, there's what? Outside, there's... Dead! Someone's dead outside! Pardon me? She's on the tree and she's so bloody and she's not moving and I think she was attacked. I heard her scream and I thought it was you and I got scared and I tired of you and, and, and... Calm down, Rio. Let's see. Ain't no way she's gonna be calm about this. And then, like, Rio, there's no one out there. Huh? But she... Come look. Okay. It was just like she told me. There is no one out there. Ooh! It was just the forest. 
But, but how can that be? She was right there. I saw her. Is it possible you were just seeing things? Huh? You said you heard a scream earlier, right? I didn't hear anything at all all night. Where were you, though, Mom? Where were you? But I think maybe you were just sleepwalking. Sleepwalking? You probably just had a nightmare. Snuck on over here in your sleep. It was probably from all the stress. You wanted to go home to your dad, didn't you? Right. I was suppose it's only natural to be afraid of staying here. Oh, silly me, trying to be a mother again. Yeah, let's add the man emotional manipulation over here. Yeah, let's do that. I'm not fit to be a mom anymore, am I? No, no, don't say that. I love coming over and spending time with you. I think you're right. I was just having a nightmare. You know, it isn't raining anymore. And the sun is supposed to rise soon. I can uh, only take you up to the bridge, but would you like me to walk you home? Yeah, I really like that. Thanks, Mom. She walked me home and everything felt normal again. I went to bed and woke up. It's all done in the morning like normal. I guess it really just was a bad nightmare. No, but I never really had nightmares like that before. Dear Journal, I'm going to visit her again tonight. I have to, because I won't be able to see her tomorrow night. Tomorrow night is the Harvest Festival. It technically starts at midnight tonight, but... We always wait until the next night to have the actual celebration and festival part. On harvest night, you're supposed to spend time with your loved ones or whatever. Then you start the actual harvest festival. I think it's silly, but I don't know. Holidays are always kind of weird. I already spent the day with Dad, and now I'll spend the night with Mom. So I'm glad in that way I can still kind of celebrate with her too. Oh, this is so stupid. You don't have to go inside right now. Dang it, dude. Haley looks saddened. I'll be back soon, Haley. You know we'd include you in our Harvest Festival activities, right? Haley's not happy with what we're doing. I'm not happy with what we're doing. We're being foolish. Let's go into town. Don't need to go into town. Everything's rolled up, too. No, no crow? I'm trying to see if I can find a crow. No crow. No, no crow. All right. Let's go see the Wicked Witch of the Woods. Let's go kill ourselves. Oh, there she is. Hey, you're back. I haven't seen you in a while. I know what you're looking for, kid. You want something subversive, right? Everyone talks about an evil witch in the woods, so you want her to befriend her and prove them wrong, right? Then it turns out it's all one big misunderstanding. She was a good witch, after all. Or maybe she was bad, and... It Took, it just took the kindness of someone else to make her better. That's what all the storybooks teach you, right? Tough luck, kid. It doesn't work like that in the real world. Sometimes people are just evil. There's no help in it. All the second chances in the world won't make a difference. You keep saying this kind of stuff, but I don't understand. Ever since I met her, she's been nice to me. She's helped me get back home. She cooks me dinner. She teaches me stuff. And what do you do for her in return? Huh? No good favors goes unreturned. She's going to make you pay her back for those favors one way or another. And I don't think you'll be ready for when that happens. I'm giving you the extent of my help. Whatever comes next, hope it works out in your favor. But I don't think I can stick around to see it. Goodbye. And good luck. So, can we go home? <laughs> can we go home? That sounds like we just go home. I haven't, we haven't really made any choices. All this has been very, for something that's three endings, we haven't really had a choice. Nothing wrong with that, but like, I'm worried like, where is the choice gonna lie? Are we just gonna speed run to mom's home? Mom? Here. Sorry if I was late. Happy harvest night. <laughs> Happy harvest night to you too. And no worries, you're right on time. I'm still getting dinner ready. I'm almost finished, though. So you can play around for a bit if you like, or just sit at the table and let me know when you're ready to eat. So, I mean, do we still have our knife? No. But the sacks are ripped open. Alright, the sacks are ripped open. Is the oil gone? <gasps> she put a crate over. She put a crate over it. A wooden box full of unknown content that doesn't mean 
Oh, she put a crate over the hatch. And the time? Ooh, it's actually a different time now. Time reads 616. Huh. Uh-huh. Door's locked. So messed up stuff happens here at night, I guess. Crate has a large crack in it. All right, no glass or anything. Mm. Oh, we can go in her room and the chest is gone. Kind of full of household items. Large bed, it's empty. Oh, she allows us in her room now. That's interesting. Cabinet. Mm, nothing here. Yep, can't mess with that. Did I already try going in the boys' room? I, I don't remember. I think I did. I think it said it was locked. I'll try one more time. Yep, toy's locked. Alright, there's not there's not much to do. She covered it. Oh, she's sneaky, dude. She's sneaky. Sit down for dinner? Guess so. Not much to do with that. Are you excited for the Harvest Festival tomorrow? Mm hmm It's actually going to be the first one I'm allowed to attend. Even my friends are going to be there. <laughs> Sounds fun. Oh, you upset? Oh, you're going to do a pity party? Is that what you're going to do? A pity party? Oh, yes, I was just thinking that one day I would like to be able to attend, too. I'm sure we can make that happen. I mean, once everyone in town realizes you don't mean any harm and stuff. Yes, maybe one day. Still, though, I'd like to be able to contribute to the Harvest Festival somehow, some way. So, I made something for it. Oh? It's this! This vial. The liquid inside looks like the red stuff from the cauldron you saw the other night. No! It's sacrifice! Don't! Don't do it! Don't do it! Don't use it! It smelled awful. The town. There's a statue in the center. <gasps> Instead of filling it with moonlight to the goddess, you, feed it, you fill it with the desires that you want. And so she fills it with child's blood. Oh! A goddess holding a chalice? Do you think you could pour this vial into the chalice she holds? It's a good luck charm. I made it to ensure a wonderful harvest season for everyone. Oh, uh, I don't know. I mean, tonight the, the chalice is going to fill up with moonlight. And it's supposed to have the same effect. Plus, um, I'm not supposed to touch the statue, really. It's considered very sacred. And, um, uh, if I touch it, I could get in trouble for uh, vandalisms and stuff. Please, Rio. I spent a long time on it. It would really mean a lot to me. You don't even have to come back after you do it. You can just go to bed at, go to bed at home. It really isn't a big deal, you know. I doubt you would get in that much trouble. And I've done so much for you, haven't I? Can't you do me this favor for me? No, we're gonna have a peaceful night here. For your mother, dude. The manipulation's going hard. After all she's done for you. What will you do? Can we take the vial and, uh, oh, I didn't, pardon me, I didn't mean to do that, I wanted to save, I wanted to save, I was taught to respect the goddess's statue, and that the only drink allowed is the chalice's moonlight, really, after everything I've done for you, I fed you, I housed you, I taught you, and this is how you repay me, as if I owed you any of those things to begin with, I know, and I'm sorry, mom, I can't do it, then, you cannot be my child. Mom? Oh! <laughs> the dead! <gasps> the dead! 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 Rio? Was that you? Goodness, Rio! Dead! Rio, how did this happen? Your leg's there. Dad, she's... She's... Quiet, Rio. It's okay now. As for you. Oh, stay away from my son. This gave me, oh, this gave me chills. There she is, the freaking evil. Oh, oh that's so good. That's so good. That's so cool. Dad. You, that magic. It was supposed to be for the festival. What are you talking about? The festival? Oh, Rio, don't worry about silly fireworks. You're more important than anything like that. 
Frida, are you... How do you feel? I'm okay, Dad. I can't feel anything. It doesn't hurt. That's good. That's good. I'm a little scared, though. What's going to happen when the sun comes back up? It won't. I'll make sure it doesn't. <laughs> Don't be silly, Dad. There's no way you could do that. Nonsense. I'll drown in this world in darkness if it means keeping you safe. Oh, because in, in daytime he becomes human! Oh! So that means he's just gonna keep it night forever. Dad, what should I do? You don't have to do anything. If I, if I sleep, will I be okay? Yes, you will be. I'll make sure of it. Okay, then I think I want to go to bed now. Yes, yes, that's all right. Good night, Rio. I love you. You'll see me in the morning. The sun won't come out tomorrow. Oh, so we died. No, I didn't freaking save! Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, that hurts. I wanted to save right before I made that choice. I promise I did. Oh my gosh. Dude, I'm so upset. Should I like speed run it? Because I want to get the good ending. Shoot! I'm so upset. I didn't freaking save. Oh. Uh, you know what? I'm actually, I think, I, I think I'm going to try to speed run it. I think this is what we'll, this is what we're ending the night on. Yes, yes, yes. I, I, because there's a way to just speed up all this. Yep. This is what we're gonna do. Okay, he wants us to mess with these scarecrows. Okay, okay. And we know where everything is. So that good crow was good. He was just really weird about it. I don't know. And then harvest all the pumpkins and then talk to our sister. So yeah, we're human during the day, and then during the night we just turn it back into our scarecrow. And I guess he just never, like, the sun never came up again. <sighs> that's crazy. Alright, that's it, right? That's all the tasks? talk to anyone. We're just gonna skim past it all. And then we're gonna definitely save before we get on that dinner table. I think, uh, yeah, I was trying to freaking save, and it just... <sighs> oh, that sucks. Okay. Plus, I want to see what happens for the... Oh, we actually have to talk to our friends. Context. Of course, we need context. There you go. Talk away. This game is actually super good. I think this game is probably better than the basement one. Only because I like the fact that it's optional. And it has a more, like, sinister thing. Because, like, you are actually talking to the enemy and growing a connection with the enemy. Instead of where it's not me, it's my basement. It's just, um, you just know that there's monsters downstairs. Yep, there we go. And there we become. Dang, she cut us in half through our legs. Right, now we go. So, mushrooms! Right? And we're not what happens if I just ignore the crow? Oh, I should just talk to him just in case it's like, Oh, the crow's there though, maybe I should say something to him. Yep, there's our cut. Tis but a flesh wound for what we get in the future. Alright, um... So she, yeah, she was just using it against us because we were no good to her unless she could manipulate us into... into doing something for her. And that's her offer to the gods. Because in her book it says, make the offer to the gods and all your desires will come true. 
that is. Look how quick. We don't even have to worry about it. Could have just went there. This is a great game, though. Great game. I just really, really, really am curious about the second ending. That's when you know. That's when you know you made like a really, really good game is when the player wants to figure out all the other endings. I just wish I saved, or I wish there was like an auto save feature. Yep, there she is. Hmm. One nice little deed, and then she wants us to destroy the world for her. The dad is so sweet, too. The dad is- I, I don't know why he would be so ungrateful with his dad. His dad was willing to freaking turn off the sun. dad like it, it puts a perfect setting so you don't need a mom you have like the best dad in the world all right we gotta light these fires so it's what oh it's this one Wait, what? Oh, I did it wrong? It shouldn't take me too long to get through this because I'm not reading it anymore. There we are. And then apparently right then and there, she's mom. So cute, so manipulative, so evil. All right, there's not much we can do here if I remember right. It's just we go to the hatch because we can never unlock that boy's room. But I think that person is what, who she kidnapped. Oh my gosh, this thing again. Oh no. Okay. Oh shoot. Okay. Uh, let's see. What was it? This soul. Okay, and then. Okay, brown caps. Headlock. And then. Brownstone. Cobweb. Probably? Did I remember? Oh my gosh, I'm a genius. Isn't this like where we go to sleep? Yep. Yeah, see, like we're back here already. Oh, it's just this part. It's just annoying with the puzzles. But yeah, she killed. Mom's not here, bro. Yeah, we never managed to open this. Doesn't even say that a key can go in it, so I'm assuming that we can't. I don't know. Alright, hot water. Hot. And then drain this. Grab the knife. Yep. 6428. I scanned this place pretty well. You know what? I'm gonna save right here. There we go. I, I should probably save more. 
And then the number was 1205. Do I really need to put the hands in? another thing. So it is a drink and that's the potion she's been working on for I guess years and that's why she's killing people not to eat them but to make the potion to basically destroy this place. What's the ladder? I totally forgot what the ladder is. Oh the ladder's all the way- yeah the ladder's in the maze and we need that for the lantern oil. Okay yeah. Yep 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 yep. Let me get that first. Where's the blood one? Give me the blood. Give me blood. 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 No. No blood. Blood. Oh, what if the guy who was writing the the signs was Ingram, and that's the person that like learned how to write, and then escaped maybe? I don't know, but I mean, she did kill people. So it doesn't really help with that either. I don't know. But it's this game is really fun. I love these story games. A lot of talking, and sometimes it like rings out my voice to death, but it's really it's such a good story though, it's worth it. Alright, and then here. There we go. Grab the lantern. Okay, now let's save. No, save. Okay. She's a witch, so I'm assuming that she, like, did something to this. Like, look at those scratches on the eyes, too. And then she's magically there. And then it's magically gone. Yep. Don't be mad at me. Haley, I'm sorry. All right, get it, Haley. So let's grab the potion. So the crow was cool. Should have listened to him. Alright, now we're here. Save. Okay. Yes. There's not much I could do. Not much has or not nothing changed. Take the vial. Yes. Yeah, of course I'll do it. I mean, it's just a good luck charm, right? Shouldn't be any harm in it. It will even bring us extra luck this harvest season, and we'll get giant pumpkins. Oh, I knew I could count on you. Go now. You should fill it before midnight tonight. I know the results will be so wonderful. I'll be able to see them from here. I promise you. Go on, then. I'm so excited. Don't trust her. Okay. Okay! No one's out here. All I gotta do is climb up on the statue and pour this in. Then just I'll just go home, like she told me. No, it's nothing bad, but... I still feel nervous about it. Okay, so let's save here and let's go home. <gasps> so we don't have a choice. So it's either this or that. Statue lives above you. Somehow, however, her po her pose doesn't seem as jovial as it usually does. Hello, Miss Luciana. Got a drink for you. <laughs> you climbed up the statue and filled the chalice. There you go. It was a present from my mama, so I hope you like it. See you again later at the Harvest Festival. Oh no, it's over. It's over. So it's either yes or no. Oh, good morning. Huh? Is, is it still nighttime? Why haven't I changed back? 
Dad? Dad, are you home? Where are you? Huh? What's all this? What happened to our farm? This is the sky. Blood red. What's going on? I, I gotta go to town and find someone. I gotta find Dad. Oh, can we can we even fix this? I bet not. Blood surrounds the grass near Haley's base. Her face is missing. Her body appears weirdly fleshy. Haley, what happened? Oh, this is what happens when you make a deal with the devil. Dude, she ruined everything. Everything's full of blood. Good gosh. What if we try to go to the woods, actually? Oh no! You know what's freaking good? I'm playing Sims Medieval? Sims Medieval is so freaking fun. Is that on the phone? Uh, can I go up? I need to go in town. Okay. No, I can't. Gosh dang it. I wish you could walk faster. I wish this was smaller. Oh no. Our house is red. Is our dad alive? What if she killed our dad? Ain't no way. Oh no. She has a smile on her face, dude. All the scarecrows are dead. The goddess is now covered in what appears to be blood. The inscription on the plaque has changed. It reads, You have fed the goddess your wishes for the harvest season. She has delivered upon you the season you wished for. May your harvest be as plentiful as you hoped. Oh, she wanted kids. The scarecrow face dripping with rough says, Body appears fleshy. Oh, no. <gasps> Dude! The witch! Scarecrows are dead. They're just dead humans. No, dad's not here. <gasps> it's just her. No, where's my papa? Dang, we had no choice to like take it and not put it in and then never see her again. There's just no peaceful ending to this. Rio, there you are. Oh no. Mom, what's happening? I can't find my dad or anyone. What happened? What happened? The harvest festival is happening. The grand start to an incredible harvest season. And it's all thanks to you. Look at all of it. Isn't it beautiful? The endless supply of food. The endless celebration with the finest ambrosia anyone can ask for. And with us running it all, I have been waiting here for so long. Time and time again, I wonder if I even made the right choice choosing this place. They all said it wasn't worth it, that I should try someplace else. But where else would I be able to reap, to reap such a plentiful harvest? All my waiting has finally paid off. It's all thanks to you, my beautiful son. The son I deserved all along. Ha <laughs> ha, I'll be queen of this world. And I guess that makes you my little prince then, doesn't it? What's with that face? Oh, don't look so sad, Rio. I've invited all my friends. They'll be here soon to celebrate with us. And I know they'll want to thank you for the wonderful harvest, too. Ooh, bad end one. Blood Moon Festival. There has to be a good end. Wait. Where do I get the good end? Now I don't know. Because if I refuse... There's no refusal here. What if I don't? There has to be like another way. Mm. I hate that. So like I I there has to be like some other situation that I could have done, maybe getting into the boys' room. It really just didn't seem possible. What if I... And if I refuse it... She just cuts me in half, right? And that's a bad ending. She just cuts me in half. So there has to be a good ending before <laughs> this, I'm assuming. Oh. 
his face. Yeah, so uh, there has to be. How many endings is there? Uh. Ending? Different ending? Rio, we've discussed it before, haven't we? You don't have a mom and made you a straw. Oh, that's so cool. 50,000 downloads, that's amazing. One, two, two bad endings, one good ending, and one true, one and one good true ending. What? Hmm. There's no video. Okay, let me see if I can look it up. Crow scare. Let me see. I doubt, though. Uh, there has to be someone who did it. Crow scare. Good ending. How, what, what, to, oh, thanks for the ads, brother. With Wix, you get advanced AI. So how do I do it? Early in the game. No, I gotta make sure. Okay, just go home. And then what? You following me? So what, did I just, like, miss a conversation with... The crow? Yeah, talked to the crow three times. Maybe there was a fourth where, where the crow was and I missed it? Talked him here. This doesn't seem any different. Crow here? to do a number for that was was there oh, it had to be something with that chest right, what's in here this needs to be a collection of books in the chest they're all children's books things like educational books and fairy tales opening up the covers you can see the library's wait library's date whoa these are way past overdue there's a note at the bottom of the pile if you're reading this and I know you can read this don't even think about it put them back before I burn them He's okay, I won't be taking any of these. Okay, so she just had a bunch of library books? Okay, what happens now? Talking to the crow again, I guess, because this is the last night we see her. Hmm. What all the storybooks tell you? Does that mean he's part of it? Oh my gosh, I, did, I just realized. My freaking... Great, I just realized for you guys. There you go, look, we're back. 
Am I supposed to only see the start screen? I'm sorry! I just realized! My gosh, I'm sorry! <laughs> I'm sorry! Okay, so what happened was that he read that this chest that was in mom's room had the storybooks in it. And that was what, I guess... I don't freaking know. That's what, I guess, um, helps track us with this. And then the crow talks about a story tale. So maybe this is where we connect it. Mm. Yeah, he says that's what all the storybooks teach you. Maybe he got turned into a crow. Okay. Oh, he dropped something. When did the key dro When did he drop it? I didn't get a key. Key dropped out on bird. She did turn him into a bird. She turned her son into a bird. And then this is where you go into the room. That makes so much sense. So I guess I just... Because I missed out on the chest, I didn't see that the chest had it. I double-checked it, too. He has to go here, right? Oh, and there he is. Oh, hi, kid. <laughs> How'd you get in here? You dropped your key. <laughs> you got me. This used to be my old room. Then does that mean you're an Ingram? The person who wrote those books? Yeah, that's me. So you were mom's son? Her uh, other son? Yeah. I feel like you're coming to this revelation over and over again. Oh, sorry, uh, why are you here? I come by every now and again to collect some old stuff of mine. Not that I had a lot to begin with, but it's not easy carrying things as little as I am right now. I see. Well, go ahead, look around, kid. I know you're curious. Oh, an old journal sits on the floor. Um, am I allowed to read this? Go ahead. Might even be better if you do. Winter, XXXXX. It hasn't snowed yet. That makes me happy. It means that I can keep going to town. I used to hate going to town because of all the scarecrows. Honestly, they still freak me out. It's like they're peering into me, drilling their eyes into my very being. They know I don't belong, but despite that, they don't make me feel sick. Not at all. Not like they do- wait, what? Not at all, like- not like they do to you. I guess that's why you make me go into town instead, huh? Nah. I think even if they did make me sick, you'd force me to go any- Spring XXX. I saw Miss B for the first time in a while today. She told me I got so much taller from the last time she saw me. She said she missed seeing me in the library and always and I was always one of her best students and learned I learned so quickly. She said she remembered helping me to learn to write my name. She started getting a little emotional about it. I did too. Learning how to write was possibly the best thing that ever happened to me. Even it comes with its own consequences at home. That reminds me. Saw a woman in town getting mad at her kid today. Outside the bookstore, he was whining and screaming and making all sorts of noise. She And she clearly had enough. You could see it in her face. She was mad. But she didn't hit him. Some Ooh! The, did, does the witch hit him? Oh, that's sad. She said I was late coming back from town today. I wasn't. And I brought her everything she needed, so she had no reason to get so angry. But by this point, I understand that she doesn't need a reason to be angry. She'll lock me in the storage room all night for looking at... What? For looking at her wrong. I'm sorry she thinks it's a punishment. But it's not like... Dang it. But it's not like my room... No! I keep freaking... I read too slow. Nope. I'm sure she thinks it's a punishment, but it's not like my room is that much bigger than the storage room to begin with. She's been getting a lot easier to piss off lately, though. I'm not sure why. But it worries me. I keep doing this and it's messing it up. It's the only reason I'm still here. Getting older, it's apparent now more than ever that somebody has to keep an eye on her. Oh, if only I were strong enough to do something about it. Get manic? Autumn, triple XXXX. I know what she wants to do now. And I know she'll try to make me do it. I refuse. The these people are her not her playthings and certainly not her food. 
and they've been more of a family to me than she has, ever was. Too many times now I listened to her because I was afraid. But this is bigger than me, and I won't let her have her way. I'm not going to help her do what she wants. Oh, this is the last straw. I'm running away. I'm going to town. I'm going to tell everybody what she's planning. I'm not afraid anymore. Oh. What a box full of unknown contents. Okay. Old bed. It's covered in dust. Dang. Where's the rest of it? What do you mean? There's no rest of it. It's all I wrote. But you talked about how you were going to run away. What happened after that? She turned him into a crow, bro. What happened? She caught me. That's what happened. And it's why I'm stuck like this. She knew I would try to tell everyone. So she cursed me to stay trapped in my bird form forever. Aw. I'm way too small to do anything like this. Not a lot of people listen to the warnings of a silly little bird like me. Aw. But you still told me. Yeah. Because a kid like you needed to hear it the most. With me out of the picture... You were exactly the kind of person she needed. Still, I don't know if I can believe all this. Mom was always so nice and your curse. Is there any way to reverse it? <laughs> yeah, but it ain't that easy. What is it? Maybe I can help. Not unless you're an expert in sawing the arms off of off grown women. What? What? Huh? Only way to reverse this curse is to drink the blood of a family member. Ew. Curse, it, curse this half-bird child. Ungrateful is he. If he wishes to fly away, then only a bird he shall be. Drain the sap and blood from your family tree. Ingest it at once, and only then you'll be free. What? Will we actually be able, will, will they do it? I'll never forget it. I hate that stupid dorky rhyme. But she set it up this way, knowing that if I ever got close enough to her to attempt, she'd crush me easily. Oh, do you want me to try some of my straw? Pardon me. Wait, what? It might work. Oh, because she calls her son. Pardon me. I mean, she's my mom. She's your mom. Then that makes us brothers. And when I look like this, well, I don't know. Kind of seems like every part of me is made out of straw. My hair, my blood. Heck, probably my bones, too. That's smart. This kid is big brainy right now. So maybe if you eat some of my straw, it'll work the same way? Try it. You're joking, right? I mean, it might not work, but isn't it at least worth trying? It's just straw. The worst that could happen is that you ate some hay. All right, screw it. Give me a straw. Ugh. Come on, it isn't that hard to eat. I used to eat leaves all the time before dad told me to stop. What kind of... <gasps> That's so cool. Hello. It worked. Holy hell. It did work. Come on, kid. Let's get you out of here. Hey, hey, I can't leave yet. Mom is still waiting for me out there. Ugh, you don't want that woman as your mom, kid. Don't you see that by now? Look what she did to me the second I said no to her. Yeah, for real. What do you think is going to happen to you? Stop yelling so much. Even if I did, even if mom isn't as nice as I thought, does that really mean I could just leave? Yeah. Of course you can. I'm giving you an out right now. Hop out the window and we'll go back to town. Leave this old witch to rot in the woods by herself. She's waiting for me out there. Oh, I should have known you been, should be difficult about this. I'm trying to save you from my fate. Or hell, even worse. Yeah, she cuts you in half. But of course you won't get it. You're just a kid. Yeah, and you're just a teenager. <laughs> Besides, isn't trying to run away exactly how you got caught? Oh, jeez, kid, all right, I get it. But what are you going to do then? She's going to ask you to do something there for her. It's harvest night. She's been planning for it. If you try to refuse her, I'll figure something out. I'm a smart kid, after all. And mom, maybe it won't be as bad as you think. Don't place your bets on it. Oh, I'll be waiting for you outside. Whatever you do, get out of the front door safely, alright? <sighs> Dang! Yeah, save. Guy's smarter than me already. Alright, you can set the table when you're ready for dinner. Alright, we know all this. Skip it along. Skip it easy, skip it along. Yeah, you can't leave. Oh, I'm so intrigued! Are you excited for the Harvest Festival? Mm-hmm. It's actually going to be the first one I'm allowed to attend. 
Even my friends are going to be there. <laughs> Sounds fun. And then here comes the manipulation. Oh, yes. I was just thinking that one day I would like to be able to attend too. Yep. Same old story that we got. She is evil. She turned her kid into a crow. She don't care about any of it. Yep. Vile the liquid. Statue in the center. It's a good luck charm. Yeah, I'm sure. She lies and deceives and deceives and lies. And where was our dad? I guess our dad turned into a freaking fleshy thing because he was a scarecrow for that bad ending that will we do this for her. Yeah, you can just go to bed and go home. It isn't really a big deal. I doubt you would get into much trouble. I've done so much for you, haven't I? Oh, he said no. Your mother, after all she's done for you? Sabotage! Oh, sure, I'll take it. Let me just... Oh, I dropped it! I'm so sorry, Mom. It was an accident. But it isn't all that bad. I'll just go home and tell everyone to take the scarecrows down. You drop. Wait! Wait, 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 wait. Whoa, 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 what, is she, what, 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 what were you saying? Hold on, hold on, hold on. But it isn't all that bad. I'll just go back home and tell me we want to take the scarecrows down and we can celebrate together and you won't be... You dropped it. <sighs> oh, no. I know, I know, but we can just... You dropped it on purpose. Do you think I'm stupid? No, of course not. I don't. I just... Outrageous. All my children know how to disappoint. Oh, wait, what? What? All my children know is how to disappoint me? All my children know how to do is disappoint me. <sighs> Mom? Oh, she's back to being evil. Huh? I'm... Nice try. Oh, let's go! Get out of here, kid. Oh, she's evil. Don't sit there, just go! Go ahead and take care of it. Dang, no, is he gonna die? You. You, look at what you're doing. <laughs> look at you. Wait, hold on. I can't freaking read. I'm so stressed out. Look at you. Doing what you know best. Get in my way. You always were a disappointment to me, Ingram. There he is. That is Ingram. I'm not going to say anything. Not even to your own mother. You can't scare me anymore. That's the real reason you curse me, isn't it? Because you knew you couldn't scare me anymore. And when I'm not scared, I'm stronger than you. Ha! <laughs> we'll see about that. You know, Ingram, despite all the heartache you've caused me, I'm still a parent. <coughs> the hell? What are you doing? Get your ugly claws out of my mouth. What? Did it make you feel better to say that? Are you happy now? It may be hard for you to see, but I am your mother. There's nothing a mother loves more than to see her child happy. So won't you do your poor old lady some good and smile for mommy? <gasps> the dad! She freaking killed him? Come on, dad, wake up! Wake up! My friend needs help! Mm, Rio? Is it morning already? Could have sworn. Rio! What is this? You, you weren't supposed to. I know, I know. I wasn't supposed to go out at night. I'm sorry. I'm really sorry about it. But my friend, he's in trouble and he needs help. If we don't hurry, she might... No. What? I took care of it. No, she can't hurt anyone anymore. But if it's not too much to ask, I do, I do need help. What did, he do, what did she do? <gasps> oh my gosh, that's terrifying! That's terrifying! She ripped his mouth open! With a little something else. Oh my gosh, he's still bleeding. Did they sew his mouth? And the fireworks are still going, so no magic was used. How about that? Oh, they did sew his mouth. He looks better. Oh, and he has crow hands, too. I didn't realize that. <laughs> see, look at that. He's smiling. What are you smiling about? Happy to see the fireworks? Or 
happy we managed to survive last night with our asses still intact. <laughs> All my friends may have moms, but none of them have a big brother like I do. Oh, that's so cute! <laughs> yeah, we're brothers. I don't really think I can deny that at this point. I'm sure anyone can see the family resemblance. I mean, look at us. We got the same smile, don't we? <laughs> that's cute! Oh, a smile to match my own! That's so much better than I got, and here I am getting the both garbage endings. Oh, this person's so freaking good at their games. Gosh, is there another one? I need another one in my life. Oh, look at that! That's cool. This one is definitely my favorite out of the two, for sure. Oh, that's great. Let's see. Uh, arcade kitten. Arcade kitten, please tell me you're making more. I mean, they got Blackout Hospital. What's this one? Blackout Ho- Oh, this is like a- This is like an actual fighting one. That could be cool to do. I'm starting to- This, this person- Follow. Uh, sweet no death. Oh my eyes, dude! Hey, it's strong. Oh, we can do this one next time. Forced cannibalism. <laughs> Forced cannibalism is coming out of this game. Sweet no death is a short horror. I'm not gonna. I'm probably not gonna play this because it's probably gonna take like an hour or whatever. Um, sweet no death is a short horror themed RPG game. This game is dialogue heavy and plays out more like a visual novel. Then light RPG elements. This game about takes 30 minutes to complete. I could. One wrong, one real. Play it? <laughs> you want me to play it right now? Oh, but it takes 30 minutes. Oh, man. I. Oh, my gosh. Alright. I'll play this one next time. I'm not doing it. I can't. I can't. You only live once. Yeah, I'll only live once Thursday. We're doing it. We're doing... No, Friday. We'll do it Friday. <laughs> Sorry, Anna. My throat is dead. But, dude, Crow Scare is so good. This creator is actually, like, I think it's probably one of my favorite creators. I wanted to get into... I'm probably going to start doing it, but I've really wanted to get into more visual novel stuff. And I think this is where I'm going to start. I was going to do, like, a second channel at some point in the future, but it doesn't hurt to, like, get into at least some of them. I think visual novels are just fun. It's fun to read. It's fun to experience. So, yeah. We'll probably get into more of that. Gonna cry and play Bin Song on drums. <laughs> Wait! No, don't play on drums! Don't hate yourself that bad! <laughs> you can punish yourself, but not in that manner. Um, but yeah, that was super fun. It's a pretty good stream tonight. That was a lot of fun. What is that? Experience insanity over the course of a week and put an end to what you've been doing. Oh, all right. Um, but yeah. <laughs> Too late. Where are we chopping? <laughs> I'm going to end it here. I want to thank everyone so much for watching and for being here. I really do appreciate it. Thank you for the follows. Thank you for the subscriptions. Thank you for the support, guys. I love you. Truly, like, honestly, it's such a great time, especially you, Anna. I love you with all my heart. See that? That's my heart, and it's for you. Um, but thank you so much for being here, and I will see you guys tomorrow. We'll be doing Dreamlight Valley and just some random games, probably Kindman then. But yeah, thank you so much, and I will see you guys later. Bye! See ya!